The thoughts, views, and opinions expressed by this podcast as well as its hosts are for entertainment purposes only. I repeat, it is not serious. It is not real. No one is exposing, revealing, indicting, or telling you anything about themselves. Also, we do not encourage you to try this at home. We are trained professionals who do not have your best interests at heart or our own. <laughs> Enjoy the show. Fuck out of here. You think you're not here? We recording. Male leading, nigga. We recording Friday, nigga. What nobody said? What's wrong? Why are you flipping on me? Nah, I'm with Flip. Male was leading on Friday. what? What time we getting out of here today? We on Friday. We come. What time we getting out of here today? Y'all acting stupid. Oh, today we getting out at ten p.m. I'm with that. <laughs> tell the audience why y'all acting stupid. <laughs> we not acting stupid. We just we tell the audience so they could be in. Hey, audience, it's Queen Flip. I saw me. So this nigga has been coming in here saying, "Yo, we got to do a pod till about eight nine, and we was getting used to leaving five. Yo, all you YouTube uh, critiquers, get ready, yes. load it up. <laughs> we would load it up. Listen, load it up. Here come T. We was getting used to leaving at five, and the nigga was- Wait, hold on, let me interrupt. Too. And we know, well, I know, they should know by now too, Joe Button Podcast T is a real job. Facts. No, oh, no, 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 that's, yeah. That nigga's yeah. making money. I see that shit. I'm going to dress you niggas in oh, Look, That's what I'm saying. They get, no, they up Just there now. Just in case y'all was confused about Joe Button Podcast T, uh-huh. it's a thing, you niggas is eating. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen, y'all, we oh, was leaving ahead, here at five. Moving and shaking, huh? it was, it was huh? a pat, like this nigga is a, a mind hey, fucker. Hey, hey, flip, we That's was why I don't really fuck with him. Y'all think I really fuck with him? I don't. This nigga three weeks straight five on time. We all comfortable. The fourth week, <laughs> nigga get up, walk. <laughs> he wanna do picture in the middle of a fucking break, and then we take it like. 30 minute breaks, then we sit back down and we go into nine o'clock and he's just sitting there like this looking at us. He don't he don't look at us in the eyes, nigga. He looks straight at parks, you know what time it is. <laughs> so we gotta just guess. So we try to leave at five. Oh yeah, we didn't do Patreon yet. So we gotta sit back down. So that's what that's what it is, go nigga. Get a so side now, girl or something. Nigga. Now today, yeah, yeah. Wanna, today yeah. we leaving at ten because he want to go watch the Nick game. Nah, nah, fuck that. Fuck that. Yeah, I'm with you. And Friday we got big male leading because he you know he going away. We got big male leading Friday, nigga. Huh? Hey, Mike, we gonna, we gonna stop her from, she not gonna unravel a lot of shit. We got itch to hold it down. Man, I'll slow down, man. <laughs> don't unravel that, but we'll be here Friday without Joe. Yeah. Because if you don't, she, she'll go. She'll go. If you don't, gonna, you gotta watch her. Yeah. She, she unravel some shit. So you don't want off, you don't wanna be off Friday? It's up to my brothers. I'm, I'm right. <laughs> if, it, if it was up to your brothers, then why you just go on that whole monologue? Word, I was like wondering, when, when you start talking Friday, Jesus. I'm over here looking at you like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Yo, I, I, I'm like, this nigga's talking too much. I was just talking about today. I mean, no, we, and we are, and we are. Well, not we, but y'all. Nigga, I'm coming here Friday, nigga. I ain't having fun. No, you coming too? No, I ain't coming. The pool open? Right. <laughs> this nigga coming to get in the pool. <laughs> oh, All right, don't start calling people talking about yo. We, I'm short. <laughs> Shit, looking a little light. Like, y'all, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, hey, hey, look, right, that's cool. You look, helping a lot. Hey, of people. Look, check yeah, it out yeah, though. Yeah. Check it out though. If, if that's the case, you know how you mentioned yo. We need an extra day to come in here and do some. some Patreon, I agree. I'm gonna make them same calls like yo. I, I'm down with that. Oh, okay. All right. So I'm, hold on. Hey, nigga, you only want. Three extra days in two years, nigga. I pay. I'm just saying, if you want to put it on that, you got to be on the other side. I, I'm too. trying to be friendly today. Hey, yo, Y'all man. let him come in here and be divisive. <laughs> that oh, is true. They, they say that. that is true. That's they true. Say nah. that on we was chilling we about was, the Nick game. Yeah, we was. Yeah, we was they they hey, flip. We you did that with you. They say that on YouTube. I don't care. I don't read. I don't know what they said on YouTube. Flip destroying the JBP and causing division. Now you read niggas. Captain, you work for niggas. Nigga, no, nigga, the work for niggas. You work for niggas. Live, I'm going in on all you sucker niggas, nigga. I'm going in on you niggas on improper improv, nigga. Fuck out of here, nigga. Eat wow. a dick, nigga. Let me find something. Huh? <laughs> Fuck right. you talking about. Sorry, man. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going in on all shot. these niggas, nigga. <laughs> I don't you know. You can never break up my brothers, nigga. I think he took what an Adderall today. <laughs> you all right? Oh, nigga. Yo, it ain't got to be so violent. Come on. What is happening? Bro, what's me? That's a bullet. That's a bullet. Don't worry. Don't worry, y'all. I ain't going to start this podcast. I got it. I got it. Hey, Joe. Joe. Oh, man. Black Air Force One, so yeah, you got that you energy. Like a McDonald's ah, worker. Get your ass out of here, bro. <laughs> you acting real Black Air Force One ish. <laughs> oh wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, yeah, hold up. Time out. I look up to y'all niggas. Them the Supreme Air Force One. Yeah, I had to get it because you be fly. I'm tired. I of your see shit. what you. Oh, you talk that Supreme. Hey, you talking about money? Listen to this and tell me what you think of this. Okay, I mean, y'all, y'all feel free to chime in as well. Sure. And then I'm starting. But okay. Okay. 
got taught in 4-4 four, four time that the dominant beat is on 1 and 3. Our band directors, our choir directors, our orchestra directors start us up how? And 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3. Now that is the European dominant beat. Mm -hmm. For Africans and African Americans, it is not 1 and 3, it is 2 and 4. Mm -hmm. I don't even have to teach you. Y'all just listen to black people clap to this song. Glory, glory, hallelujah. <laughs> yeah, that is you are clapping on beats two and four. <laughs> <laughs> if you got some white friends, they'll be clapping like this. <laughs> Is that what that is? Oh, uh, no, no, no. Why do no, you no, 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 about no. the white people clapping on the wrong part of the beat? <laughs> Man, chasing the beat. Where the beat go? Good times. Microphone check. Man, I'm gone. Now I'm on a high. Word. Damn, what a great. That was great. Joe mm Biden. -hmm. Uh, 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 That's back when the Molly used to be. No, <laughs> 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 That's back when you used to tell her, go ahead, stick your tongue out. <laughs> stick your tongue out. No, I got to put. I got to do it. I got to do it for you. I don't trust you to do it. If you do it, <laughs> we're going to have a bad two days. <laughs> I got to do it. Come on, stick your tongue out. He right. You don't do drugs. You don't get it. The Molly error. The Molly error. You, you couldn't let the good, yeah. before they stepped on it and ruined yeah. it, yeah, yeah, you, yeah. Could, it you couldn't trust her to take the Molly herself. She was going to do it wrong. She's gonna take too much mm -hmm. and, fuck and act whole... like a fucking idiot for the rest of the night. <laughs> Start passing out. Thought you was on some Dalai Lama shit. Yeah, you sounded crazy yeah. just now. No. Non drug <laughs> users no, didn't people understand. People out there know what I'm talking about. Stick your tongue out. Yeah, she was, out there she was a willing about. participant in all of that. Yes. yes. This yeah. wasn't no funny shit. And they no, they, weren't, they didn't even they get the stick and tongue out part. They didn't understand it. Yeah, they wasn't there. They wasn't there. Non drug users don't understand. Man. Y'all wasn't inside. I tell them. Never mind. <laughs> I wasn't allowed to keep me in the house. <laughs> Fair, when I tell them stick their tongue out, it's for something else. Exactly. It what? ain't for no Molly. What's oh, what's the rain oh, drops in and I did your own job. And in the side, my mouth open wide. Flip, can you stop saying so I can? What do you mean? What you nothing. Ain't nothing. You ain't. Can you explain? I didn't hear what he said because he's whispering on the podcast. No, I'm not. He don't want to say it out loud, niggas. That's why I was singing it in the, the way. The man was just singing the exactly. loud. And then you hating ass nigga. I'm on your ass today. <laughs> <laughs> don't hate. Stop hating. Uh, I'm being biased. I was about to say, so I can't even play. <laughs> <laughs> say it. Anyway, no, nigga. I ain't saying nothing. How is everyone doing? What episode is it? 619. 619. Mm -hmm. Hey, you guys out there. Welcome to episode 619 of the Joe Budden Podcast. I'm your humble, loving, warm embracing host Joe Budden here with amazing people really great cast that we have here for you guys today <laughs> Melissa Ford is here you may oh, know her hey uh, <laughs> Big Flip is here hey Ishes here Ice here Parks here Pobles here Corey's here and E hey and hey. that is the gang how's the everybody doing here. amazing great how y'all feeling you feeling good feeling great. Great. y'all look, looking good you're smelling good summer body loading Speak for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Speak for yourself. Still waiting on my cousin to send me these fucking cholesterol pills in the mail. Hey, nigga, send them shit. <laughs> Why don't you try Ozempic? That's the new craze out in L.A. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is that? What the fuck is that? The Ozempic shot that everybody's trying and getting super skinny. It's a shot? Yeah. It's like a needle? Oh, yeah. Fast. yeah. No, no, no. I'm, 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 I'm cool off shots. It's a little tiny gauge. You'll you'll basically just feel a little prick. Listen, a tiny little prick. It's not even like a safety pin I'm cool off shots because they just tricked me too. to take some shit called Moderna. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm cool off shots. That's, a little That's all I'm saying. That was a little prick too. It was a little prick. Yo, but nah, they got this other shit that everybody taking. Um, Some shit start with an M. It's Moderna. Some, some diabetes <laughs> medication that's yeah. making everybody mad skinny. Yeah. No, that's, that's it's Ozempic. It's Ozempic. Yeah. There's, two, the there's two diabetes medication that's called Trulicity and Ozempic. Shot, she just explained to you. Mm -hmm. You don't know everything. It's not, I didn't say I did. Look, <laughs> stop, stay out the comments, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, but, uh, they said this. The, I got two of those Ozempic. But I started talking to y'all about cholesterol and y'all started talking to me about <laughs> weight Summer loss. Body. <laughs> Summer body load and you said uh, speak for yourself. I'm talking about Inside well, my on. fucking stupid ass cousin scared the shit every day. Well, you know, 
well, our bodies are a machine, and yeah. once, the, once the cholesterol is in there, what people don't know is it's in there, it's in there forever, and there's no way to get rid of it, so you gotta, nigga, send the fucking pills. <laughs> okay, when he sends you the pills, I'm gonna need you to stop eating those bacon, egg, and cheese bagel sandwiches. Look at you want me to live. You're on my dick. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> We're kind of like having you around, you know? Oh, I mean, joking. I just... I, you Yo, know. Melissa trying to make oh, me think man. that the bacon, egg, and cheese is bad. That's a New York staple. Holy shit, it's fucking terrible. It's a New York it staple. Is, I, listen, let me tell you something. A There's bacon, nothing, egg, and there is, is nothing it's like really a bacon, bacon egg, bad. and cheese it's ba- just delicious, toasted though. bagel sandwich, especially after you've been drinking. And you got and some hot the, sauce on it. Oh, too. oh. Oh. What do you eat for breakfast? <laughs> Let's try this. Oh, gosh. Rice. Let me hear. Yeah, pretty much. I, Wait, like, rice? No, grass. Like, no, no like rice. Gra- grass, for real. Like, grass. I eat, like, a shake with kale and blueberries and, and flaxseed oil and chia seeds. Like, it's, I fucking they don't even, hate they don't even, But they don't even make a shake. No, you don't. No, I make you this drink myself. But they don't even make this at the bacon, egg, and cheese bar. No, I know no. they don't. So, wait, I'm going to get this. Well, I mean, they don't make that. They definitely have juice spots around here. They one thousand percent have juice spots around here. But I will come. I want juice. Let me tell you something. I will come (laughs) in. I will make you guys some shakes. I'm good. No, I'm straight. No, You, you got a shake that tastes like a steak. (laughs) <laughs> no. I'm no. Cool. no. Some no. pork steak? Shit. Word. I promise you, I fucking hate this shit. Put some fat back in there or something. Yeah. I'm from, my family from North Carolina, man. What we do you eat for breakfast if you're trying to eat healthy breakfast? Seriously? Oatmeal. Um, but <laughs> I the, the, better with oatmeal some fruit. the better oatmeal is like the steel cut oats. Steel cut? Yeah. What that mean? Never mind. I used to disguise it up. But no, what does shit. it mean? Steel cut oats are not, they different than the instant oats that we typically make. The steel cut oats are more healthier for you. They don't have as It much. takes a longer preparation it's time. A, to prep. They, so niggas will, Corey, no. They, you soak yours. Because a lot of people will soak their shits overnight. Mm. It's, to eat healthy, yo, it so takes a... That's not like no air fryer shit. Okay, nah. so <laughs> I have like... You can't see it, but I have a... Bl- have you noticed that I I've have this thing? It. Okay, Your so... Birth, little birth control pad. <laughs> it's not my birth control pad. <laughs> I didn't want to say nothing. I'm like, damn. <laughs> so, <laughs> Out in the open, right? <laughs> Mel got this little... She, why don't she hide the birth control? <laughs> <All right. laughs> <laughs> what am I, anyway, what am I saying, controlling? I'm not getting any dick. But anyways, um, so... <laughs> Mel, how long do you think you're going to be allowed to get that off on this podcast? Yeah, none of us care, but how long do you think you're going to be just for the record, off. we don't believe it. Yeah, and we, but and it's none of our business. We, we don't care, care though. But we, we don't we, care. We don't believe it. But enough now. I yeah. really, honestly wish that it. I was lying. I wish that I was. Okay, I'm. I'm holding out for some good shit. You mean like dick is in penetration? You don't yes. mean someone with a dick didn't come rub the head on the. <laughs> All right. No, 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 come no. on, come on, come on, yo, come on, let's keep okay. going. Come on, you were saying. No, I was saying, so this is a. <laughs> yeah, why do what this Hey, you know what? Let's take a brief intermission. Can all the men, can all the men in here tell me about the time where they told the girl that everything would be fine because they put, because you put a pillow divider in the bed and you could come sleep in the bed and we won't do nothing because the pillow divider is going to stop us. Mm-hmm. Turn that heat that's how on she, seven thousand <laughs> in my room <laughs> to melt the pillow divider. What does that do? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What does that do? Wouldn't oh nothing. You Canadians, boy. <laughs> oh, sorry. It's cold sorry. in Canada. So. You Canadians. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Oh, it's regular. Shit. Okay. I... Anyway. <laughs> how, how long is? <laughs> The pillow divider. <laughs> no, you like, we good. Ain't nothing gonna happen. Just I'm a, that way I'm you'll a grown. That, that way you'll have your side and I'll have mine. What? I'm grown. <laughs> how long? How long? So we gonna keep it real. How long? <laughs> the pillow divider. <laughs> Twenty five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, <laughs> I get up and Petey Pablo that shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, come on. Man, that, that shit the fuck out of here. Oh, man. Yo. Oh, oh, shit, yo. The pillow divider. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga be sounding mad sincere with it. Yo, I'm grown. Yo, what you yeah, mean? Yeah, you're about that. Like, come on, on, man. I'm tired Wrong anyway. You, I mean, I'm going to sleep. You don't touch me. Don't touch me. <laughs> don't touch me either. Don't put <laughs> don't your legs over here. Don't touch me either, guys. you. That's oh, funny. Man. Don't put All your right, legs over here. Mel, back to your little patch. It's a blood glucose monitor. Wait, what? Yes, it's a blood glucose monitor. So I have an app on my phone where I can literally put it against here and it will tell me my blood glucose. Oh, shit, you AI. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. Hold on, it's AI, this. Mel. Let me try this. Wait, so what's well, the hold on, what? You're about to do it right now? She's about to put a cartridge in her? Hold on. <laughs> 
Oh, <laughs> 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 shit. <laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> see, She's about to upgrade. Oh, see, she the real. So the skin? Oh, my God. Ish, you better get this. Y'all say, man. Just scan? <laughs> you better put the chip in there. I don't have that. So my blood glucose is 91. You're diabetic? No. Oh. No, I just wanted to monitor my gl- my are blood you, glucose why? level so that I... Are know- you anemic? Huh? Are no. Anemic? No, I'm just like on the diet plan that I'm on. I just want to keep an idea as to where my blood glucose is because when you don't eat or you eat like some bullshit, you have all these spikes, which leads to like um, headaches, which leads to uh, you know, mood swings, which leads to... Oh yeah, you don't get that too much. I see what you mean. Yeah, so I mean, I just, it's just a... Shut up. It's just... It's a monitoring... Shorty a little baddie. <laughs> Shorty, <I'm> a... <laughs> it's just a personal monitoring system Ooh, so that I know the... that I'm within range. You are AI. Yo, that's crazy. I love this. <laughs> this is AI Mel. I love talking to the girls that claim they don't get no dick because then you get to hear some of the reasons why. Like, <laughs> y'all hear this stupid shit. <laughs> I, I like to Let me take my, my mind off first. Hey, yo, fellas, y'all, y'all do realize it's a, y'all do, y'all do realize it's yo, a Wednesday, if right? If you stop doing all this 50 year old bullshit, you might do some fun. Yeah, not too, oh, not too much on mail, guys. Woo, not too you. much on mail, though. No, not too, no, stop. Oh, stop. Because you're not funny. Cool. Leave mail alone. Nah, you stop, too. You said something crazy earlier. Relax. Mel, you got the chip in you. <laughs> I'm, it's AI mail. Yeah. It's, I mean, oh, I'm a little addicted to looking at my blood glucose level. Scanning <laughs> my shit. Addicted. addicted. <laughs> anyway. No. Uh, where would you guys like to begin? You was on your man Frank Ocean. Frank Ocean. Let's start there. You got to start with Frank. He had well, it's Coachella. Coachella. It's mm-hmm. not Frank. It's Coachella. Coachella was this past weekend. It was. Mm-hmm. What? I'm waiting. I don't know. Waiting for what? Talk. You to talk. This is the conversation piece. No, you said it's not you Coachella. Said you... it... I said it's, it's not, not Frank. It's, Frank. Coachella. it's Frank. It's Coachella. Like, Coachella, this past weekend was about Coachella. It was the Coachella weekend, both days. There was a lot of stories coming from it. Uh, what were some of the stories? Lotto diss Nikki. Got it. Cool. Uh... And Frank. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I didn't yeah. see the lot of one. All I heard was Frank. I, yeah, me yeah, too. I didn't see the lot of one either. Now, when the Frank stuff started to come out, which was, this was Monday, mm. I didn't go to Coachella and I didn't watch Coachella, but in a lot of clips. So you, you kind of want to take that with a grain of salt. And what, when you hear someone didn't do a great job, or when you hear that it was trash... If you're not there, like, what can you say? Yeah. Well, start, start prior to that because Coachella was live streamed, mm-hmm. but Frank's set wasn't. Mm-hmm. So oh. that's where it starts at. I would have watched that too. However, we have seen Coachella headliners before dead a live stream. Yeah, certain mm-hmm. people have done it. So even the, alar- even the alert that that sent out to me didn't, didn't mean nothing. If you're a headliner and you want to dead that shit, you tell yo, fuck out of here. Like, man. I know Kendrick does that a lot. Like Kendrick, Where Beyonce, say, yeah. you'll, you'll, he'll be on, like, for example, he headlined Summer Jam a mm-hmm. couple years ago, and they mm-hmm. streamed the whole show. Actually, he didn't headline. He was right before the, the headliner. Mm-hmm. And his set was blacked out, mm. and then they came back on after he was done right. and with the next act. Okay. Because a lot of times these <laughs> artists are, if you're a headliner, you might want to treat the audience with an unreleased song, a new song that's coming out. No, the live stream can't get that. Also, that, a lot of them are touring actively in the middle of a tour, and I don't mm-hmm. want to spoil my tour yeah. the way my shit for looks. Sure. Uh, yeah, gotcha, gotcha, all gotcha, that gotcha, shit. Gotcha, I'm not gotcha. giving that for free. For free. Right. That makes Fuck sense. Out of here. I was about to ask why, but that, that makes it's, sense. It's so many and, reasons. And there's a bunch and of reasons. other reasons. Some of these people be having, be having contract yeah. deals with this platform over here. You're That's live true, streaming true. over here on whoever. Well, I have a personal deal with your gotcha. competitor. No, you can't live stream me on this. the ice and flip fight. Yeah, or it's just as simple as you got to pay me more for that. Yeah, yeah. We're already paying you a bazillion dollars because you're the headliner. No, no. Right, well, the the headliner no don't come with the stream. Yeah, you want to stream, you got to pay for that. Oh, these niggas getting that money. Yes, facts. So social media was coming after Frank for performing or a lack of performance and also being late, like ninety minutes late. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, but like you said, when it comes to festivals and also not being there. You don't know what was happening behind the scenes. You know, like what could have, like, transpired that made him late and also why he had to shut down his performance at the time. Because apparently Coachella was uh, fined, like, over, 
like almost two hundred, one hundred and twenty thousand um, dollars because they kept ending late. Mm -hmm. o overages. overages, yeah, overages, yeah. exactly. Overages. If y'all are going shit. past a certain time, yeah, night we, ordinances. We're taxing noise. you twenty yeah. x, mm -hmm. and one hundred and twenty thousand dollars. Coachella is not much money. No, it's not. That's, it's not. But but didn't. Don't they do that in New York, right? They, they do, do that. that. Like, every, 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 every like union wages and all that shit. Y'all got to be out here nine on the dot. Everywhere. Nine everywhere. 15 Literally everywhere. Is That's, if you're gotcha. at a performance venue, you have to abide by the, the strict time the, rules. Gotcha. Yeah. Or pay. But now, then the story started circulating that he did some reworked versions of his songs. Mm. Mm. And that's where I start to say, that's peculiar. Then when I did more research and saw more of the clips, I'll tell you, the first thing I said what, to myself was something is off here. Coachella, I'm used to seeing the budget behind you. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. This looked like the exact opposite of the budget behind you. Well, it also came out, I'm sure you saw it, that the, you saw wanted it. an ice skating ring. Well, let me read that. Yeah, go ahead. Well, let me read that. Let me, re let me read this crock of shit. <laughs> Uh, and this is from Festival Owl. I've been speaking with sources about exactly what transpired and how things went so, so far downhill Sunday for Frank Ocean Coachella. So here you go. The stage production was supposed to and did contain an ice rink that was constructed and ready to go. Before I read any further, <laughs> did y'all hear that? In California. <laughs> in a desert. ice rink. Yeah. He had an ice skating rink in the desert. I want to tell y'all how Some many money, different money. times I would have told Frank Ocean to suck my dick. <laughs> oh, okay. He probably would have. Oh. Nice. <clears throat> what do you mean? Go ahead. <laughs> I'm allowing my codes to speak. I'm out of line. Nah, I'm go Please. I'm going Share down the dark alley. Nah, nah. Oh, okay. An ice rink. And you're wondering why they want AI to replace us. <laughs> Pause. But okay. <laughs> Nigga, you but okay. shit. And you came 90 minutes late. We're in a desert. Well, listen, well, ice rink that was constructed and ready to go. So they did it. <laughs> they did it. They did the ice Frank rink. Frank decided at the last minute that he no longer wanted it at all. Pause. See, nah. Sucker Frank. <laughs> <laughs> ice skates. No, 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 you get out on this ice skating oh. rink money. Tell Frank to suck a Frank. <laughs> <clears throat> I think he might have to do something else. Yeah, that's, come on. Tell me the pussy. There you go. <laughs> you decided at the last minute that the ice screen ring that we just worked on. Built in you the desert. Are that we, that in the we desert. hired contractors and consultants and all that shit to come up with in the middle of an outdoor festival in California that you don't want it. We now. brought ice to the desert <laughs> in That's a state ridiculous. that doesn't have water. All of the people working around him Oh, all of the people walking around him at the start of the performance were actually ice skaters, had been practicing for weeks, and were supposed to be skating as part of the production. Coachella had to deconstruct the approved stage, oh, they had to get approved, that had been planned and signed off on for months in advance, and melt the entire ice rink, and then set it up how Frank decided today, with no warning. No, it sound like he don't fuck with them. Yeah, it sounded like he pulled the Jared Carmichael. I don't, yeah, yeah, I don't mm. fuck with y'all. So I'm just going. But we know that that can't be true because half of us know about Coachella from Frank, Frank Ocean. That's true. Yeah. He even got up on stage, and this could be a, a bunch of cap, and said, he gave, the, he gave the speech. I used to be here dreaming about the day I could perform. Me and my brother used to come in and, and, and rest in peace to his brother. You know, he told a heartfelt story about how they used to come to Coachella every year and dream he was there. So, okay. I mean, I know. I'm not saying no, two I'm just, things could be true. No, because you know how you talk about when you mentioned the other festival, uh, Rolling Loud and shit, and you were like, yo, they should be giving certain artists equity because they X, Y, and Z. He might feel that. Hey, dog, I, I'm, niggas know about me because of you, know about y'all because of me. Uh, I wouldn't go that to, far. Not that, but. I wouldn't go that far. Yeah, I'm not going to say that. Coachella right. was very You're right, you're right. But he did I a lot some for people, Coachella. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of well, people, a lot of people that didn't. He did a lot for them. We bailing niggas mm -hmm. out. Yo, fam, you're a professional. Don't sign up to come do this festival if you don't want to do it. If True. you have a beef with us, stay your fucking ass home. But True. that was my Gerard Carmichael take, and, and you said it was wrong. Yeah, I don't... No, I... I that could be a power totally play. totally different things. It could be a power play, though, ish. Stay at home don't really... 
Let him finish. Let Fuck me, up the festival yeah, for the fans reading. that paid their money? Uh, Frank decided with no warning, uh, which is what you ended up seeing, and caused the hour-long delay. This all happened when doors had already opened for Sunday and people were securing their spots to see him. If the last-minute changes weren't made, he wouldn't have performed at all, leaving the festival without a closing headliner. Suck more dirt. Mm. That is crazy. Frank story. also personally pulled the plug at the last second on the live stream, which left a very sour taste in many inside Coachella's, uh, Coachella mouths. Ultimately, and I quote, it just didn't seem like he wanted to be there but was obligated to be. Everything, including him, fell apart last minute. Do not expect to see any coverage from the festival about the set, something that is unprecedented in the history of Coachella. The relationship is not in a good place right now. Well, it's going to be mm. really interesting since he's supposed to perform next weekend because Co Coachella is two, two weekends. weekends. Yeah. So he's supposed to like repeat this. Sh this. I would cancel him in a heartbeat. In a heartbeat. Facts. I and replace cancel him, him in a New York second. I'd be on anybody's no phone right now. It would be no headliner or... Or all, all Coachella heads would have to get together to find a replacement mm -hmm. like they did when Kanye, when Kanye mm -hmm. did. It. Yeah. It's a festival. I'm sure there's another star that's where I need to step worthy up. Worthy to be a headliner. And I gotta say, being on speaking on Coachella, there was other news that came out. You gotta shout uh, Metro Boomin for his performance. I heard that shit was crazy. He he brought him out. Mm -hmm. I heard it was crazy. The weekend, future, twenty one. Like he the niggas did not expect all of these a star names. started the right, set right. from him yeah. on, on night one yeah. to come support and him. you're not even a, the headliner or nothing you brought out acts that are Co Coachella closers mm. in your set and did all your records yeah, like future full. weekend Coachella closers yeah yeah and he it, brought he, he was able to bring them out he wasn't set. on the main stage I think mm, no I don't yeah they sure. said he they said his shit was like the it shit was the, of the it whole was night the, yeah. that's all I saw was talk about Metro's performance night one that's how you make a splash damn yep it. facts <laughs> that's how you get on the main stage yeah yeah that's true but nah I, what I, the fuck is wrong with Frank I disagree Ocean? with that yo with what like I, that's the fans fault cause we tend you. to bail people out sometimes for doing bullshit mm -hmm. like I ain't about to bail no I'm just saying if you got paid Accordingly, you're supposed to perform, dog. I yes. don't give a fuck what your internal beef is. Mm -hmm. You have an obligation to perform. Not just that. I think a lot of times we start losing. The fans are what pay us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you if, you, if you beefing with Coachella, you owe it to your fans to put on a good performance. And it's like unfairly weaponizing your fan base mm -hmm. against mm -hmm. someone mm -hmm. else. Because like they probably blaming Coachella. Yeah. Coachella, yeah. Mm -hmm. Him Frank, being a dick. Frank is like... The word I like to use is it's like... a scammer. Eclectic. I, I was going to use right. the word Eclectic. mercurial. That was the word what, I was going to use. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> what is that? What you is use that? it in a sentence? <laughs> I, 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 using it, he's... Um, the word would mean like uh, he's not easily to, easy to get along with. You know, he's... Um, Why well, we must save this nigga? Hey, yo, Look at you. Yeah. I'm not... Yeah. Hey, yo, Frank, yeah. you a, a sucker. Yeah, that's a lot of Came cat. on me, you a sucker. Mercurial. Stop making it worse no, no, no. for other motherfuckers. No, 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 hold on. <laughs> Stop making it worse for other niggas. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Represent the culture right. <laughs> Fuck are you doing? Huh? Oh, I'm born under the planet Mercury. Okay. Yeah, it makes sense. Hot headed. <laughs> Hot -headed. McClario. You ain't McClario, nigga. Go use that ice skating ring next week. Do it properly, nigga. Make your fans proud. No, that's you know what I'm saying? It's the fans' fault. Excuse me? It's the fans' fault. Why no, do you think not, this why? is? Because, yo, I don't even. They, they put Frank Ocean on this pedestal. I've been saying for years the nigga's overrated. He well, hasn't. He hasn't really even performed anything since like 2017. He was, a, he was like Prince. All of us just sat here high for the first. For well, how many records? All of us just sat here high. For how many yeah. records? Not me. I never heard none of those records. That's my thing. You got. You gave no, us Frank a couple Ocean of joints. But the rest truth. of us sat yeah, here. Yeah, I've got a lot. You gave us a couple of joints and niggas treated like Prince. A lot. Frank Ocean. I don't want to hear that shit. I don't care. I'll all stand on that by myself. I don't care. you, nigga. Frank Ocean has been overrated and he don't. Deserve all of this shit. Uh, Big Freeze been overrated. Sub Zero. Frank man. Ocean is fired. He's not he's overrated. That doesn't, that doesn't overrated. Shit like that, y'all saying that shit is why he's doing the bullshit. Exactly. You ain't fired, nigga. Excuse all of that. Oh, Fuck he's out here. Do he's right. He's, he's eclectic. He's, you can be fired and be a fucking everybody don't dick. Have to, everybody do not have to speak at once. Y'all are all passionate about this. Please allow everyone to get their Frank hate or love out at this moment. <laughs> the We'll, we can start with ice because like he said, started. Every, every, a lot of people use all these words. Oh, he, like you said, eclectic and all this other shit. Bro, you are an artist. If you want to do the whole disappearing act and I don't give my fans music for X amount of years and all that shit, bro, you did not give enough 
classic. Frank Ocean has three classic albums. Mm-hmm. Barks, can mm-hmm. you not interrupt? Sorry. Ice. And what are they? See, Nostalgia <laughs> Ultra. It's not an album. It's a mixtape, but I'll, I'll, I'll allow it. Go ahead, though. Channel Orange. What else? Blonde. You are out of your blonde mind. <laughs> oh, <laughs> You're out of your blonde Whoa, mind. Yo, blonde and endless. You get them the fuck out of here. Both of them shit. Endless wasn't it, but. Get them the fuck out of here. I'll give you Channel Orange, Nostalgia Ultra Classic Mixtape, and that's where it stops. Are you finished with your... <laughs> Is you okay? Yeah, I'm just... I don't like that shit. I've been saying that about Frank Ocean. Like, people put him up on this super high pedestal like he is just that nigga, and you not. Nah, he is. Do you, think cause, so, do you think because he don't spread himself thin, he doesn't do too much? Nah. So the want? Pause. Pause. <laughs> what you saying? Why, is, why is it that you think that he's overrated? He just told you. Uh, yeah, no, just no, 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 no. Like, b- besides the classic album. She clerical album. details. No, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Mercurial. What the fuck is the word? From Mercury. <laughs> McClarical. <laughs> McClarical. What a fuck. What the fuck? What? Hmm? You said McClarical. I know, but what you about to say about me? Nothing. Oh, all right. I'm on your ass today. When you wear black and you got shit over there, I know you up to today. You look at you about to pull a stunt. I don't like that. I'm not pulling up. I'm wearing black because these niggas had my gooch, gooch all out. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. But you know what? Yeah, yeah. your pointy point blame- was out. <laughs> but I'm blaming that on on y'all, on my crew. Why? Why the fuck you blaming I, on I don't one, have an angle I'm on your pointy. I'm 100 percent blaming that on my crew. Please I would love to hear this. this. You guys you. were I'm supposed sure. to be I'll, on Gooch Watch. I'll give it to you. Look at your angle. Look at your angle. Look at your angle. Maybe not you. You I definitely have to look at this you. man's Gooch. Eric, Eric, yo, Eric, you need to get on Gooch. 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 Eric, you fell off with that one. Hey, yo, you said you were supposed to be on Gooch Watch. It was a Patreon. Look at Gooch. It was a Patreon episode <laughs> where I said to y'all, yeah, I just feel like when you come in here, coming in here, you got to be like dressed, have your shoes on. Don't just like, I feel like that's part of the gig and it's professional. Like, I don't want to come in here barefoot, short slouch, like that's just going in. Y'all were like, nah, I feel like the fans like that shit. I remember it like yesterday. Okay. I feel like the fans really feel like they here with us when you do that shit. Okay. So I come in. <laughs> no. Like a whore. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I came in and let it all hang out. Bro, you came in. I here. was comfortable. With your feet out, was I was fine. comfortable. Yeah, your feet, feet out was cool. That's cool. <laughs> Fam, you came out here with your pink lips. Nah, nah, yeah, hey, I'm with you. Yeah, nah. I'm gonna stand up. Stand up. Stand up. <laughs> nah, you need, two, up. you need two minutes. Stand up. Nigga said pink lips, yo. <laughs> Nigga said you had your moochie out, yo. Your <laughs> <laughs> <The> moochie. <laughs> 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 Yo, bro, the niggas bro. had you with your motherfucking <laughs> nigga wore all black today. Yo. He wore all black and bought gifts. It's a baggy <laughs> shit. He wore, he wore, all, he wore, oh, man. he wore all black and bought this gifts to, to remind us who he is. We see you. Shit on. Shit. Oh, oh man, yo, that's funny. Oh. <laughs> I mean, your business. This nigga try to blame it on us. Anyway, yes, oh man, little camel toe. Uh, Anyways, you were, you were, oh, damn. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I hate when my camel toe shows. I'm gonna rip your little chip off. (laughs) I'm I'm gonna rip your little AI chip off. Why do you think I always got my legs? You won't see your heart (laughs) move those material. Your 91 level. (laughs) Listen, you fucking fat bastards. Shut the fuck up, okay? Oh, Oh, she got him! She got him! Oh Oh, my god! Mel, oh, man, yo. You to him like that? You are a lady. You didn't feel me a phone, nigga? Yo. You said what? <laughs> Sorry. All right. Can what? y'all get back to oh, our oh, argument, oh, please? Because we're not shit. done. Oh, I, I, I Ice, Ice is done explaining yeah, why he's over. I love you, work hubby. Don't worry about it. Okay, oh. so anyways. Um, wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 I don't want to do it. <laughs> so stupid. Part. Oh, yo. April. Huh? <laughs> oh, shit. May. Shit, May. May the 4th. The Canadian calendar. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it up. <laughs> May. Okay. Oh, shit. Part. What's up? You go. About what? Oh, <laughs> shit. Frank Ocean. You go. I'd say he's got three classic albums, but you don't have to be a dick and show up late. But True. people that have classic albums seem to do this. He's not, not all. Not all. He's not all. Not all. Not all. Yeah. He's following the footprints of Frank 
Ocean oh, is Lord Hill. a scammer. Why is he a scammer? <laughs> Another one is overwritten. Never mind. Now it's wait, wait, wait. What? No, Lauren go ahead. No, no. Is... I used, no, no, no. I used to no. like that bullshit. I just don't like Lauren Hill. It's cool. I want to hear what you were saying about You said she's overrated? I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm not doing this. Okay, Joe, you were saying that Frank Ocean is a scammer. I'm not saying now. Okay. Yo, You're you... from Newark. <laughs> I said Big Jersey. My nigga is from Elizabeth. No, he ain't. Hey, Star <laughs> nigga, shut up. Yeah, that's I'm a blasphemous. That's crazy. Watch yourself. I, I shoot. Go ahead. <clears throat> Frank Ocean. You said he was a scammer. He's a scammer for the way he got out of his uh, universal contract. That's I think that facts. was genius. That was genius. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think that was genius. No, I think most of the scams are genius. True. <laughs> Found a loophole and took it. So he'll he'll always wear the scammer tag for me. That fucked up a lot of artists. He didn't care. Lost a lot of artists' yeah. revenue stream. Yeah, that he fucked didn't up a care. lot of shit. Took Apple out the game. He didn't care. I don't. But I'm not so mad at that. Okay. Everyone used to do exclusives before he did that shit. What did he do? The pink and the blonde. Apple ex a Apple blonde exclusive endless. Endless. Mm -hmm. What's it deals blonde where endless. Apple endless, comes yeah. and pays a shit ton of money to have the project exclusive to Apple for two weeks or week, whatever two weeks. it was. Got it. Okay, something mm -hmm. like that. Frank Ocean was in his Def Jam contract, mm -hmm. so he could not do that. He had one album left to deliver to Def Jam. And they had had a hard time negotiating around that. Mm -hmm. It's rumored that Apple gave Frank Ocean the money to give Def Jam to even everything out and handed them an album. And then mm -hmm. he was out of that deal. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But the very next day, <laughs> he, he, he <laughs> came out with the other he album. put out his real album or the other album. On so he, Apple. Yes. yes. He doubled up. So Apple people, cool. <laughs> they were happy. Universal, not happy. heated. <laughs> and they said, all right, we're not fucking with y'all no more. We are banning all of our our whole label from ever fucking with y'all again. 33% of the music. Ever business. doing exclusive yeah. deals. All of that shit stopped. <laughs> and it's, that was the last, last time. Yeah. Uh. But now, hey, you got to do what you got to do. So I'm not mad at him for that. <laughs> I right? wasn't mad for that. My counter to ICE is... Frank Ocean made Channel Orange, mm -hmm. and he made, what's the mixtape? No, Nostalgia Ultra. Nostalgia yeah. Ultra. Of those two projects alone, coupled with his work with Beyonce and Hove and just, his greatness was recognized early it was. from industry insiders and heavyweights. Mm -hmm. It wasn't just fans to, to put this false crown on him. He was that nigga early, and he showed and proved as to why early. I'm with you on Blonde, but I also recognize that I'm the minority when I say I that. didn't like Blonde when it first came out. I like Blonde is not now. for me. I keep saying I have to go back and listen to it. I, I haven't done so. I tried it, and I, was, I felt to the To me, same. Blonde is like to pimp a butterfly. They kill me for yeah, that, too, but yeah. they both just pieces of art, not musical pieces I'm going to run back to. Mm -hmm. My problem with Frank Ocean is my problem with J Electronica is my problem with fucking uh, uh, Black. It's my problem with all of the artists that feel like they can drop every six years. Bryson. Bryson is mad of them on that list. Frank also, I'm giving credit for like kind of ushering in a sound and mm -hmm. style that has carried on to present present right. day so right. even if he's not so active his presence and what he's his impact is felt mm -hmm. almost damn near in every other R&B record mm -hmm. you got a whole wave of children out there mm -hmm. so I'm not going to try to fuck with his genius what I will say though is so what they still should have told that nigga suck my dick get the fuck out of here if you, if you are more of a headache than I anticipated you being, and we are who we are with just Coachella, y'all not relying on Frank Ocean. And I'm sure you're very expensive, too. <clears throat> but, but Yeah, I'm going to say I'm gonna save me some I'm not fucking with this weirdo. But yeah. they thinking that this going to be some fly shit. All right, yeah. cool. You pushing the envelope. You're going to make us spend a bag. Uh-huh. 
We don't want to, but fuck it. We're going to well, spend it because we're going to get it off. To that point. Y'all could have got the baby Hold for on. a quarter of the price. A quarter? He did that for the look. A quarter. Yeah. No, you, know, you get what I'm saying? Hey, he's, he's cleaning himself up. Stop. We're going to spend the money because we think it's going to come back. Well, right? I will say this to that point. The day of, my nigga? For you Hour to do of. that the day of? It's crazy. That is crazy. Out of line. That is some wild, and to me, that, 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 shit. That says intentional. But he makes it hard for, he's going to make it hard for people in the future. That's it. Like Joe he said. He don't care. Did. That nigga don't that perform he don't nowhere. That's, that's Superhuman. He don't perform. That's my point. That's 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 scene. He don't he pop don't do out. Shit. So he don't care. If, like in a weird pop. way, this might help the nigga. Probably. He's one of them weirdo. In a weird way, it might help Coachella too. This is, this is. All press is good press. Frank Ocean yeah. did Mentality. rock and roll versions of music. Yeah. Yes. That doesn't surprise me. Yeah. Next, somebody going to ask to jump out the sky. And I'm not paying you to come do the rock and roll version of my favorite songs from you. I want to hear the song. Depends. That's constructive. Nah, they I'm, said I'm they you. said his set list was questionable. I mean, you know, I and just, you know what's funny? You know who else you does that? Late. You know who else does that at their performances? Who? Lauren Hill. Facts. I have never been to a Lauryn Hill show. I would only be going. She's known off to be mer mercurial. <laughs> she is, but I'm saying she'll show up late mm. and do like the. This, the she don't do no rock the version of no song. No, she, 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 she changes a lot. She, she does, changed she a lot. It don't sound like you'd be like, whoa, whoa, whoa! I'm recognizing some of these. Lyrics. What song is this? It'd be like that. I'm kind of okay, okay see. but I, in, to keep this in perspective, Lauryn Hill is also not a Coachella headliner right this second. Mm -hmm. Like, you have a different level of expectations mm -hmm. because Coachella is involved. Fam, we pulled out permits. We had engineers. We had all of these motherfuckers construct you an ice skating rink. Yeah. For that, the last minute. That you like, condemned at the last shit. minute. But this, is, but this is what was a smack in the face. Because as an artist, I still kind of give grace. <laughs> while When these stories come out about a bad show, there's a lot that could be going on as an artist that Behind it's the just scenes either not your knows. night your team, y'all not in sync that night. Like, a lot could happen. But that story that they fucking put out about he hurt his ankle the night before yeah, crazy. is a slap in the face. Mm -hmm. That's a slap in the face to anybody with eyes that can read, anybody that's a consumer or a fan of his. He's not a point guard. My nigga, you had the ice skating people, the skaters. <clears throat> what they was doing, dancing? Yeah, like, niggas yeah he to had it. He, he, for, apparently, um, he didn't even sing his songs full way. You know, at some point, he just started twerking on the stage and the ice skaters started dancing and he had like a mini fucking rave on the stage. So everything just, it, it was, I'm not going to, it was I'm fucking gonna, chaos. I, I'm not going to, I'm not going to kill him for not singing the songs. Cause yeah. I just watched Drake go up there and, and let the audience do karaoke sing. Yeah. for 40 minutes at the J Cole set. Mm -hmm. And it was great. So I'm not going to kill him for not singing the songs as much as a, a fan of performance. I want to see him perform the, perform the set. I understand that some people don't really care about that. Yo, and then the one line that all of all of us would have loved to hear, even if everything went bad, the one little line, he got the nerve to say, what did this nigga say? Not to say there's not, a, not saying there's not a new album. I smacked the shit out of you. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about, you fucking idiot? Everybody is here for your stupid ass who ain't put out music in ages. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. And you can't even confirm if there's new music coming? Not to say that there's not a new album. <laughs> yo, the arrogance of these niggas, yo. <clears throat> if, if, if that if, whole celebrityism. Leaning in the ice. If that's the fans allowing that bullshit to happen. That entitlement. That, so that's, that's why they get it off. And that's the reason for you saying that he's overrated? No, I've, just, I've had a whole bunch of, I've said a bunch, I got a bunch no. of reasons. But I'm just saying, I don't, I think fans should not allow that. From from what they gonna don't do? give me the, the bullshit. What they gonna do? Yeah. Stop fucking with you if that's no, the case. There's no there's, there's no the there's of fans that's not. R. Fuck, Kelly not is a perfect example you. as to how why people will still fuck with you no matter what the bad headlines are for years and years and years. As long and listen, we are suckers for as long as you put out a good fucking product, we Stop want it. Stop right there. Mm. He ain't put out a good product in years. But we're still dancing to the fucking that's my shit point. that he did in fucking but, but that's 2012. My, he's not even performing and touring and doing those records. Y'all are giving him a pass off the past. 
He hasn't given you nothing recent. He doesn't. Current. Don't even tell you I got new shit coming. He, and y'all are still holding him to yeah. this high regard. He's literally. From sure. But the, that a but, decade ago. But, but the people that hold him to a high regard are doing so based off quality. Yeah. Those people feel like every time out, he provides a different level of quality. It's yeah. the same reason that I'll never kill Scissor. Hey, you take a long time, but you cooking. Yeah. When but it he, come out, I can it? hear the, where it took I'm, a long I'm, time. I'm with you. And if he gonna come out and do that. Cool. If he's not, SZA will tour. SZA will do a show. SZA will give you a Lucy, a single, or something. He ain't giving you shit, one. Two, I'm doing shows, and I'm doing versions of the songs that y'all don't like. I done fucked up all the records now. When I do pop out and do a show, at what point do you say, oh, my nigga, I'm cool? I would have done that, personally. As a music fan, you're not going to keep playing in my face and getting my I money. Want, I want a Will Me. Smith app on my phone. That can send a hologram Will smack. Smith out. Smack, what do you mean? <laughs> smack the shit out of people when they just start bugging. Yo, That's stupid. what I would like. And that that is my conclusion to the Frank Ocean topic. Now, I don't want to be phony. I'm, well, I'm going to be phony because as soon as he drops music, I'm purchasing it. Mm-hmm. Same. Without question. Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't need to hear a single. Yep. At 1201. No, no, I'll be on there. 1145. 1200. Wait, refresh one. <laughs> Pulling the screen. Come on, give me something. Now, in, in, off of Frank, but in, in live performances, um, I went to go see Wayne last night. Okay. Now, I came in here before when we talked about the verses and shit, and I was saying how, because Wayne was doing that, playing like rock versions of the songs. He was. Heavily auto tuned. It just didn't sound good. Uh huh. For a live show, um, Wayne did. I believe it was Amazon. He did a live show there. Okay. And it was the exact opposite of all the bullshit he used to do. Mm. And I was, I came in here and I'm like, yo, he smoked it. So he's currently on tour. His tour is called Welcome to the Carter. Okay. So he's doing all the shit from Carter One to Carter Five, new <laughs> records, um, mixtape shit. Like he he gave probably an hour and a half, hour forty five minute set. Dope. Live band. Everything done right. Like, I don't know, something, something switched with Wayne. Like, now he, he looks, I said this before, he looks healthy uh-huh. again. He looks like he's sober. And he's really given amazing, amazing live performances. Might have got a better band, too, or a, a music director or something. I feel nah, like I, I mean, look. even before he would go on stage, it would be a little slurry. Yeah. Like, oh, he okay. would be. His actual performance. Him. Mm-hmm. Gotcha. I mean, him. It got better since. <laughs> Might have got better when he sold his catalog. And I'm joking, by the way. You know what I mean? It's a lot of that happening. So, and, and that, that big bag kind of make you feel a little different. Now you got to get out and really work. He's doing, one thing that did shock me, he's doing very small, intimate venues in his way. How big was the venue that you saw him at? Maybe 1,000, 1,500 oh, wow. times. He did Apollo in New York. Mm. Yeah, that was the New York show. Yeah, that's small. Like, all the venues are small. Huh. But... Well worth it. If you have a check for a stack. Yeah, the tickets. I think he's just like evolving as an artist. You know what I mean? Like he's super like cerebral, like really like incredibly intelligent and shit like that. And really like worldly and shit like that. You know, Um, this set list, there was not a record that anybody walked out of there and was like, damn, why he didn't do this? mm -hmm. Like even people that I ran into, shout out to Mona. Don't call me white girl. We was having a blast. Um, Everybody was like, yo, this nigga. Yo, put some more respect on Big Mona, too, when you say a name. Don't say it like. I just shouted out. You know. Big Mona. My bad. Pardon me. Big Big Mona. Not the little one. Not the little one. safe. She kept it safe. She, she kept, kept it safe. You bet you here, ain't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, oh, that's what happened? <laughs> ain't you sitting right here? Yeah. <laughs> say less. Oh. oh. <laughs> but nah, it was just <laughs> like, you could just tell. There was a, a deep focus put here, mm. and it was appreciated. Like so, I always shit on people when they come in and do fucked up shows. So I just want to do the opposite. Salute the good ones. Yeah, salute the good ones. I like it. No, that I shit was apologize. Oh, you, did you apologize? I apologized apologize before. Apologize. I got to do it again. Oh, well, right. as long as you I'm apologize. done. Apologize. I'm cool. we got you. Yeah, like I ain't <laughs> apologizing again. I said yeah. what I said, nigga. I'm only coming out for the legends and icons. Like I ain't mad at Wayne, Usher. You knew me. Niggas, bye humbug. <laughs> I'll catch you niggas. Well, I won't even come to the festival and see you. I ain't going to see y'all. I'm cool. I'm going to see y'all on my screen, maybe. 
Yeah, I'll live stream it. If y'all join caffeine. <laughs> Shouts to caffeine. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> I don't get enough credit. Anyway, what else? Oh shit, are y'all hyped for uh uh Swiss Wayne Hove Friday? Swiss Wayne Hove. Yes. Friday. Yes. And yes. issues too, even though he doesn't know about it. Wayne gonna dance all over. That this. sound crazy. Ooh. I'll take it a step further. That's fire. I'm not mad at a Wayne and Swiss project. I kinda need that. They have be been, they have been, if you really, they've been, everything that they've just jumped on together has been that. And Wayne said that Swizzle just sent him a bag of beats. You know what I'm saying? Every mm. time he, he just sent him some shit. He don't ask for it. He don't nothing. He like, yo, he just like, sent him it's, shit. Them records just, it's like crafted for Wayne to just jump in and out of pockets. It almost feels like he made it specifically, here, you do what you do on this. The fuck uh, though? Shit right there, got yeah, yeah. From that one, yeah. I don't know when this record was done, Wayne. but I don't care. I'm gonna have a little bit of fun. <laughs> Wayne needs some get back. Stop stealing my fun. <laughs> my fun. <laughs> it's true. And you show where the card is too soon. You gotta draw this out a little bit. <laughs> Wayne has cable. Well, Wayne was there, so he doesn't need cable. He sat at the table. No, the fuck no, he didn't. Did. <laughs> <laughs> no, and that's, that, and that's where the get did. back comes in. No, he did not. Yes, he did. No, he not did. A, His verse came first, and he walked from a dark corner somewhere. <laughs> he was walking around. And sat at the table. Sat at the table. No, after, no, after he walked from a dark corner and rapped, Got he stayed by John Legend's piano. He was in the smoke for a little bit, and then he was able to come sit down. Not right next to Jay. A couple seats there. Go down here. Mm. It's a big table. <laughs> it, it was. Really you big. Needed, you, needed, you, needed really the, really you needed the wide shot to catch him. <laughs> and Wayne heard the... <laughs> you need, you know... Yo, freeze. He did. <laughs> Employee he, of the month, April? He wasn't, he wasn't Peter. He was one of the other disciples that will know the name. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. And Wayne, he was Wayne, Joe, and Wayne <laughs> heard the rumors about... You know, the whole verse. He saw Hove go on Twitter talk spaces talking about the verse. He seen Hove talk about the verse everywhere. And I know Wayne got to feel like, nigga, if I'd had another 12 bars, 16 more bars, I know he might feel yeah. like that. Pause. So, this record will tell me a lot. It's going to tell me if these verses are new or old from either of them. Just from hearing Wayne on this, it's not old Wayne. Mm -mm. Wayne is coming the tear fucking hove head off. 100%. And Wayne also, when that little list came out recently, was like, right. all the people ranked above me on that list know that I'm number one. He said that. Yes, he did. Mm -hmm. He was really I'm, talking to hove. He said, I'm number seven. I'm better than all of them. All of them. And they know it. Don't ask me. Ex ask ex them. Excluding nobody. <laughs> he said it. Not even the deceased ones. Excluding nobody. I don't think he believed it. But me either. I don't think really that. But it don't matter. He's you supposed said to it. say it. He's supposed to say it. He said it. He's standing on it. He said it. And he's standing on it. I think, he, I think he does believe that. What makes you I think he really, doesn't believe that? I think he really believes that. I think he's I mean, been believing I, I, that. I, some people just say shit to say shit, but. No. It's different, it's different when you walk around and, and, and act on it. Like you know, Wayne, oh. Wayne has been yelling the best, I'm the best yeah. rapper alive. And from the minute Forever. he said it, when everybody started saying, nigga, shut the fuck up. He said, okay, I'm going to show y'all. Mm -hmm. I'm going to wrap my ass off nonstop. For a decade. For the next, yeah. We'll see, well, we'll see and just keep record. doing it. Wayne is. I'm out rap all I you almost want to say Wayne is damn near tricked people into even putting him in this conversation. What? Psychology. But well, first all, off, but that, all the greats do that, so I'm, I'm gonna not going to knock him for All the greats it. do Everybody. it. But Wayne, it falters, it, 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 it hinders what? him having all of the mixtape classics. I'm listening. They're mixtape classics. Okay. That everyone can't get their hands on. Inadmissible. Everybody yeah. ain't here. In, inadmissible in court. Everybody haven't heard them. Yeah. That's not part of it. That's not part of our... That's Rucker. You in the Rucker. You in the Rucker part. But, but, but I got the other classics too. No, you don't. No, you don't. You have two of them. You have two. What do you think are his classic albums? Two and three. Yeah. I'm saying I have, though, I have classic you have two albums classics. too. And then if you want to put one of the compilations with the crew... 
you might have three. No, no, there's no, no classic two classic albums, albums, but a lot of classic, classic. a lot of classic, Girl, but a lot of classic songs, Girl, moments, classic features. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm not mad at that personally, but please don't think I'm saying Wayne is not no, him. He's him. Mm-hmm. He's him. He's I'm him. just saying part of what hurts him when he compared to other hymns is that. Because we go but with whole, we're like, oh shit, that's our joint of uh, reasonable doubt. That's mm-hmm. ninety six. Mm-hmm. Then we be like, oh shit, remember uh, the dynasty? Mm-hmm. We got mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. like all of those some of them records shit, are go in to play. A tape, not the masses that. Yeah, yeah. Fair. yeah. Wayne has bling bling, which is off of a fucking that album from ninety eight, ninety seven. So I'm just no, saying, no, like, I didn't say he don't have that, but a I'm lot of those classic mixtape moments are not. I'm, in play when I go when I go to search Joe Budden shit and please I'm nowhere near this conversation but when I go to search for my shit my best moments ain't in play that's true it's mixtape shit okay so you it's are the way same thing more for familiar him. with Wayne's catalog than the masses no no I'm not that's the thing that's the part that's where and this is where they call y'all New York bias I didn't say no, that hold on I'm I'm, expl- I'm explaining it to Ish he just said I'm more familiar with Wayne's catalog than the masses that is not true. No, the masses know these mixtapes. The masses that's, know that's Wayne. That's where his argument the, is. The masses know, the masses know these Wayne, mixtapes. period. Okay. All of these, these I think y'all confused. niggas today are I Wayne's think, sons. I think y'all they confused. all know these niggas. I think you're confusing the masses. So I'm not. I think you are, actually. I, I, from a fan base, somebody could go say, yo, I bought this Jay-Z album. I bought this Nas album. I bought this blah, blah, blah album. For a lot of Wayne's greatness... Everybody didn't know that this mixtape right here existed. The common fan. Now, rap fans, yeah. But a lady in a woman in such and such might not have never heard that mixtape. Fam, I'm not talking about mixtape. That's mixtapes. the masses, though, I'm, right? No, it's not the masses. Okay. Wayne has Lollipop, a Millie, Six Foot, Seven Foot. Those are classic Wayne records that are on albums that are classic albums yeah. that have... They are on the same oh, album. Oh, the same They're on the same album. No, they're not. No, not. You Them name songs three you just songs. Six foot, all... seven foot is not on a Carter three. You're right. That's not a classic song. That is one of his you got records it, ish. You got. I'm it. just naming you Wayne records. And it ain't there because he took it off. But it's the same era. It's the same time. It's Carter four. It's not the same era. It's a different album. It's it, years bro. later. But I what I'm care. saying is Wayne has those. Re- I know y'all don't because it's. Y'all don't accept y'all New York bias. Y'all really don't. I don't have a bias. You have a New York bias. I just said Lil Wayne is... I don't have a New York bias. Okay. Because the niggas, some of the niggas I like, they're not from New York. Some of my favorite. I can rappers. have a New York not bias. From New York. I, I don't like my New York nigga. bias. You can. He's from New York. Acknowledge it. That's all. That's all. But that's that all ain't why do. New York bias ain't why Jay Z is better than Wayne. So, and that's what you sitting there saying. I'm like. not saying that. Then, then don't introduce my New York bias. I did not say that Wayne is better than Jay Z. I'm telling him where he says the ma- I'm confusing the masses. I'm telling you that the masses are I, a lot I, of the masses that I are rolling away. I think y'all's debate is doing this in a circle. That's what I thought. Okay. Yeah, y'all, let it y'all go. is doing this. But let it go. to be clear, I hold Wayne in extremely high regard. High, super high. Extremely high regard. Super high. Maybe top six for me. Top seven on everybody's list. He should be. And there's a lot of people that'll have him at top one, maybe two. I don't That's talk to okay. People. I don't talk to those people. That's, that's, that's fine. I don't speak to them people. That's fine. How could you speak to them people? Very easily. Very easy. You think... Well, you leave it alone. <laughs> leave it alone. I know Coogee rap. I wasn't outside selling drugs. My bad. Uh, uh, my bad. My bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Flat I'm sorry. I'm sorry. My bad. bad. Ice. Granddaddy IU, I'm sorry. Rest what? in peace. Rest, rest in peace. peace. Rest in you, peace. you say it. I just said rest I, I, in no, peace. I said it, damn. My bad. But why are you shitting on? Why are you dissing people? I'm, I didn't I shit on anyone. I didn't shit on anyone. It's that passive aggressive <laughs> yeah, compliment nah, yeah, shit that these new niggas do. I'm not going to say you that. I don't feel like arguing, There's debating. Nothing. I ain't, I'm, I'm good. But we're not even arguing, debate. Who's the second? Who's the number two on your list? Who, no, Wayne's number one on your rap list? No. Oh. Is he number two? I understand your argument. He's not number two of mine, but I do understand. Oh, so argument. shut the fuck up! <laughs> I ain't talking about it. I said I understand that argument, yo. I understand it too. No, I just said I don't I talk said to I those people. I said I understand that argument, though. Wayne has checked off a lot of the boxes that would put him up there. What is he on your list, Ice? He might be three or four. All mm. right, then that's cool. But then that's the niggas fine. that everybody else have up there, like the box and all that, is not in my top ten. <sighs> 
All right, let's move on. Yeah, we can move, <laughs> on. move on. We can move on. See, that's why. Respect, respect. I know. Go ahead. Go say it. Look. No, no, no. Say it. Look. No, because you it. want me to say no, something say it. bad. Say it. And I'm loving you today. I'm loving you today. It's not bad. I'm fighting back with love. I'm fighting back with love this year. Y'all ain't going to trick me out of my spot. Y'all ain't going to trick me out of my spot. Shit going too great, and I be getting too mad. Nope. I am quiet as a church mouse. You don't think we ain't nice? Yeah. Wait, we moved on. What is going on? He went from wobbly to real G's moving silence. I love that line. Crazy. Real G's moving silence like the line. And had the world fucked up for about a year. I love that line. (laughs) Had the world world fucked up for like a year. What are you talking about? Lasagna? (laughs) That shit was crazy. Everybody did that. Like, huh? Y'all just stupid. (laughs) (laughs) You're a rapper. Or that. I got it right but away. He's I'm dumped, not a rapper. But because oh. I'm a, it was just a dope line. Though. That shit was amazing. The fuck? But because I'm a rapper, Bad he clever. fooled me with the simple line. The simple line fooled me. Yeah. Like the other one, I, leave I still him dead got in the, the living, living room. room. I didn't told you. I never understood that line. It must have been years until I was doing laundry one day. You're like, stupid. wait, because yeah. I got that one. <laughs> yeah, we got that. Wait, you looking at the living room? <laughs> Like the living <laughs> room. <laughs> that's all. I think it's nice. Nigga said, I still got division like the line between two dots. See, that's where you lose me. Nah, that's division. The division. I know. Division. I know. Get out of here. Division. Anybody can do that. Them other, them other lines, niggas can't do that. Niggas can't do that. Niggas ain't doing dead in the living room. That boy good. The living room. That boy is good. Even saying it like that is funny. The living room. All right, come on. What else? What else? What else? What else we got? What else we got? What else impor- important or unimportant? Melissa Ford, Jonathan Majors. Jonathan Majors. Okay. All right. Um, Jonathan Majors has been dropped. Allegedly. Okay. We don't know these things. We Allegedly. So the alleged part is that either he parted ways where he walked away from his PR agency and his longtime management company, or the other part, the spin on the narrative, is that they dropped him. And the reason why they dropped him is because of the charges that were filed against him on March 25th for assault and battery against his significant other. Uh, Shit's fucked up. It's fucked up. It's fucked up. What's fucked up exactly? The fact that he's getting dropped by longtime management company. Nothing's happened. The case has not moved anywhere. And he's getting dropped. I'm not capping for this much. You gotta. I'm not capping. Stop I'm not. It. Stop Joe, it. Please let Melissa finish. I'm not going to open my Get mouth. Get your mic. Please talk on the mic. Please let Melissa finish her yes, door. Absolutely. Yes, stop. No, no. There's a lot of men in here. She's the only woman. Let her That's finish right. first. Rock out. <laughs> Thank you. I'm just saying there has not been a trial. There has, there has not been anything except charges filed against him. The person that it happened against. There's, a, there's so much that we don't know. There's so much that hasn't been uncovered. There's so much... That's true. That's true. I just think that it's really fucked up to demolish this person's. Oh. What? Can y'all stop laughing? I hate when y'all do that, yo. Can you <laughs> stop raising your hand while she's talking to you? Come uh, on. That's, that's, how, that's the polite stop. way to do it. Were you finished, Melissa? But well, she's done. She could call on him. No, finish. Ain't nobody interrupted. No. You yeah, but y'all making faces. Okay. Y'all raising exactly. your hand. It's making it a tough foot. Like, stop. I hate when y'all do hey, that. Hey, yo, stop your phone. No, but we hate when you do that, bro. Stop. <laughs> yo, shut the fuck <laughs> Yo, go ahead. I'm just saying that nothing has happened other than charges filed against him. Mel, shut your ass up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I tried. Mel, stop, Mel. Stop. Go, go stop, ahead. Go stop. ahead. Why, what, stop tell, what are you caping. telling me to stop? Why, the nigga I, why was, is this caping? The nigga was caught. Were you the, in the fucking the car? The nigga was a cute, But you can't pick and choose. You be picking and choosing when wow. you like a nigga, Ooh. a dark skin nigga with muscles. Stop it. It's and either light skin or dark skin. You picking and choosing for that nigga. Who gives Wait, a fuck no, how no. good of now I'm getting at him? <laughs> Who gives a fuck how good he is? I heard other niggas did less and you was on their ass. Other who? Niggas, who? Give me a I fucking... Forgot. Give me a, it, I, I forgot. <laughs> other niggas did less. You said, oh, you can't... You, you're, 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 no, you're, 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 let me finish. No, you didn't let me finish. Karen, oh, you didn't no, let me finish, finish, so Karen. shut the... JBP, JBP, why would you be without the JBP? <laughs> and we're back. And we're back. <laughs> <laughs> Things got a little heated here on JBP. I understand what Melissa is saying. Do you guys understand what she's saying? I do. Um, I get what she's saying. I think that... I think that... She's saying innocent to proven guilty, right? Indeed. Okay. Uh, My my only... Oh, go ahead. I think that um, for his PR people to have dropped him and for his management to have dropped him, 
I think some information might have been privy to them that has not been privy to the masses thus far. So I think that you're not going to turn down a bag of working with one of the hottest niggas out and up and coming unless something else has revealed itself. That's what I think. I don't think so. I don't think nothing else. Well, that could be true, but I don't think anything else needed to be revealed for them to kick him to the curb. Well, it's more of a nothing has come to the light to sway us from kicking Otherwise, you to the curb. Got you, got you, got Your you. lawyer's little thing didn't help. Your girl or fiance or wife's thing didn't help. Whatever she had, none of that helped. So we're cool. And it's mad little young fly niggas to put in this spot. Better to get you out of here early while we could. What is he? He's in low key. Ant Man and Avengers, he's slated to be in coming Two, up. Well, yeah, Two he, got, of them. he got a couple more joints. Yeah, he got a Marvel. Got, yeah, yeah, but I'm saying it's enough to whereas let's put the new Malcolm X in now. Mm. I did see a, a, a cock sources sketchy rumor that Marvel was going over the idea of possibly recasting. Really? Mm -hmm. That's out there already. Yeah. They talking about Damson, <laughs> Damson Idris. Mm. Like, they're looking at his replacement. They're looking. Allegedly. Like, they're done with him. It's over. Yeah, this, this to me doesn't bother me as much because it's his management team and his PR that are moving away. It's not like he's getting dropped from, uh, you know, a his studio agency or, or you the know studio. What I mean? yeah. But that's what, to me, speaks volumes. Yeah. yeah. Like, that's, that's, what, a little bit more that's what speaks yeah. more. Like, if, if the, the studio dropped him or if people that are not directly associated with you drop you to get away from you, uh -huh. that's cool because they're strangers. Right. Mm -hmm. If your team stops fucking with you, mm -hmm. to me, that seems like there's some validity in something that's been Something's said. going on. That's hey, what, what could have happened is, you know, when this first broke, we kept hearing people say, there is video. Maybe somebody saw that video. True. That is true. So that's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, it's been a, it's been a month or so, month and a half, mm -hmm. maybe. Now something might have surfaced that we didn't know about before. Because for your team that this? makes money off of you, to leave you alone, that's more than some strangers at a fucking studio. Yeah. yeah. Mel, you think, and you said you think the fucked up part is uh, people cutting ties with him before anything is actually proven in yeah, court. Yeah, because honestly, it's like, the narrative gets spun before the truth comes out. Everybody is always working really hard to spin a narrative where they will come out on the right side of history, but they don't know what that is going to be. You know what I mean? So we don't understand. We don't know. The management company could have, I don't know, investors or something like that. Old white men that are like, yo, this nigga right here, cut that shit loose. We got word over here, but we don't know what's happening behind the scenes, but the Hollywood industry machine is extremely powerful. And he is a black man, and we don't know the truth of the situation is, but if it comes out later that he is in fact telling the truth and that he was being maligned. It matters now. It, huh? It won't matter. It, exactly, but what will happen is career ended for what? Because for, headlines can Ruin can ruin your, your career. Career. exactly that's and, the game and you win. exactly but yeah. that but that's my point that's my point so it's not caping for him i could give a i could give a shit about jonathan majors i don't know him okay like he is a great actor i enjoy seeing him on the screen because he is extremely fucking talented and when he is given a script he acts his motherfucking ass off okay i feel the same way about a, a litany of other actors and actresses and stuff like that. I'm not caping for him. I'm just saying that not enough facts have come out about this particular situation for everybody to just throw him the fuck under the bus and walk away and just act like, okay, well, let's, that, let's, let's wipe our hands of that. But that's the only part that, I am, that I'm disagreeing with. Mm. Enough facts have come out for people to be able to distance themselves from him. And the way that businesses work in this country a lot of times is they're not waiting on facts. But it's been a minute. They didn't just do it immediately. Right. It's been a minute. And this is his team. Yet they, again. That's what like, I'm saying. That, that, like, yo, dog, it's been about a month and a half of potential gathering of information. Mm -hmm. it's, they didn't just immediately sever ties with him. It's been a minute. So typically it happens overnight. They didn't do it overnight. You get yeah, what I'm saying? It took, it took a little second. It took a little it while, a little so that's second. what I'm that's saying. What there what might have been some me. investigation. Yeah, we saw that, something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, I agree. So we can move on, but that's my thing. They didn't just immediately sever ties with him. It took some time. I don't know. That's my stance. Well, the thing about innocent until proven guilty is 
they might not even be approved guilty. We might not be going never to go court. to trial. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Never go to trial. So then you're only left with court of public opinion. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And that's why I think that for all of us, even us now, because we are in the public spotlight, dog, you got to kind of start moving and carrying yourself in a different manner. You never get in a fight with your girl in an Uber. For the fact that you are a celebrity and that shit could get misconstrued, you got to start handling yourself more responsibly and using better judgment. Agreed. Totally agreed. But we can armchair quarterback his True. actions all all fucking day. True. The reality of the situation is, is that like a, a, a explosive situation happens in the heat of the moment. Mm-hmm. And on, the only two people who seem to know what actually happened in that moment is him and her. Because this video, whether or not it exists, it has not, it has not been revealed. Usually if there's a video, it's almost a month later, would this shit not have been leaked already? Maybe, Don't maybe you think? Not. Dep- depends. Maybe, maybe and not. If this was an Uber, there would be a third person that would have witnessed That this. is true. But right. my thing is this. Even that. You when, have to have better discernment. I, I, it's, and, it's, and if, and if, but if you don't, then you suffer the consequence. Yep. If you don't have better discernment, hopefully your partner does. Like I, I believe that you and your girl, there's a way for y'all to fight. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. Like, and I'm, please, I'm not condemning. Uh, I mean, condoning. condoning, condoning DV at all. But uh, like five year olds, baby mom. When that, all them stories leaked about Fabio, oh, he's going to jail, loud argument, was abused by Fabio, baby mom said. Dog, ain't nobody call the cops. We don't call the cops over here. That was the nosy fucking neighbors heard some shit. Call the cops. Tell niggas to mind they fucking business. Me and him are good. He ain't touch me. I'm here. What we doing? They let him right on out. Come on on. Facts. That was the end of the story. That's all you heard. That's how it gotta be. See, women, women, see, we don't really have the power. Women we can don't. end the story, escalate the story. They can. Mm-hmm. And you know what happens when they be, oh, man. Go ahead. What were you going to say? In times of emotion, Mm -hmm. you're emotional. And so you're like, yeah, I'm going to get you. Until you understand, yo, damn, getting him and getting me too. Oh, no, 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 that ain't happen. It's too late. You can't recant. Because now you left it. Or then the anger passed. Yeah, that's what mm -hmm. I said, the emotions. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get your ass. But then now you understand, yo, in getting him, it's also getting me. Because he might be the breadwinner. So when he starts Mm -hmm. to lose income and he starts to lose jobs... I'm going to suffer as a result of that. Mm. So some shit I might have did being spiteful and making, not saying that she made up no lies. I don't want to be mm. inconsiderate. I'm just saying when you start moving like that, you got to consider all things in that moment. You have to. Oh, this, or, or this starts to happen. And now she feels, I'm sure she feels some sort of way. She can take well, her text, text messages text indicate message. that yeah. she feels some sort of way. Mm-hmm. There you go. That she feels some sort of like responsibility in how things transpired. You know, and we're also like forgetting about the fact that he's the one that called the cops. He's the one that placed the call. So that's what I'm saying is like there is so that's much. His bad. That's his bad. That's his bad. That's his bad. That's his fault. We handle this in house. Let me tell you something. You are I, correct. I have been in situations in my home where I felt afraid and threatened, but I felt like I could not call the police Mm -hmm. because you're going to call the cops here and And the cops are going to say man, man, man. woman, you're a man and 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 you're famous. Mm -hmm. You're a famous man. Cops is a record of things, a record that you can't keep track of. Once he put it in the little thingamajig, write it down like dog. He bugged out with that one. I agree. He bugged out with that one. Prayers to everybody involved. Definitely. Uh, I mean, I get it though. You I understand what part? you're saying. I understand why he might have wanted to call the cops. I wanted to call the cops. Because I see where this could go. You got to live with those cops. You, I'm in an Uber with you. And get he, it you out. Sir, could, it you, off. Sir, could you pull over, please? Dog, when, when I call the cops, this is how this is going to go. What, is, what do you think she's going to say when you call the cops yeah. on her? Yes. That is true. We're going to separate y'all. Oh, motherfucker, you I got your cops. story, and your story is the truth. Yo, she was wild, and I was afraid. I didn't know that I'm famous. Da, 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 da. She gonna be like, now what you think she said? Mm-hmm. Bruh. And now you're going to jail. Even if and she said the right... This whole no, shit. Even if she said the right shit, what does the headline say? Because she don't write that. Yeah. She don't write the headline. She could say, no, it was just a misunderstanding. It was a disagreement. Blah, 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 blah. The headline says, Wham. And one of the no, but domestic situation, shit, all so they type. They don't. Marks they word that shit to sell papers. Mm-hmm. No, but police leave when the woman, when your significant other says, 
it, it wasn't a big of a deal. It was just an argument. They'll leave. No, that's unless, not always true. That, um, most of the time, 85%, unless they see visible marks. And even, I know somebody that we know, we, I can't talk about that, but even if it was blood coming down, like, nah, and you said, no, it's a misunderstanding. Out here in New York City, they're leaving. They, did, right, cool. they did whomever a service. Because if it was some blood coming down, the cops have the discretion to take you in. They did them a service, my nigga. Not if the nigga said, not if she off, cool. off the back says what she says. All right, you got it. Mm. I'm so, saying prayers to everybody, everybody. all parties yep. involved. Yep. Mm. That'd be the last little Michael B. Jordan, Jonathan Majors photo shoot we see for a little while. Mm. Michael B. Jordan, get the fuck away from him. We also. <laughs> hey, I, I hope y'all enjoyed all the little ebony. Hey, are they emasculating? Hey, look how fast the conversation can change. I guess it doesn't matter anymore, <laughs> goddammit. Um. Nigga went home and thought it was Creed. <laughs> Yo. We also got to send our prayers to Jamie Foxx. We don't know what the medical condition is, but the word on the street is that it was a stroke and an aneurysm. Mm -hmm. um, and they are, there's not a lot of information other than what somebody is apparently in the comments talking about. You said that. You don't have to do that with me. Like, I'm going to come right in on my cue. You know? <laughs> he said that. Like, what do you, you don't have to do that with me. I'm a pro. I do this shit. No, I was saying, uh, see, now I come in town and corner. But, I was oh. saying, because you're the USA, the fuck out of here. In the comments, right, we only even know Jamie Foxx is in the hospital because some girl said, listen, my mother came on last night and told me that Jamie Foxx checked in the hospital. She's saying this in the shade room comments. So everybody was in the comments like, oh, shit. bitch, your mother about to lose her job. You have gotten your mother fired. She about Thanks. to lose her job. Yeah. <laughs> I'm about to lose your job. Yes. Yo, so they erased the comment in the next 20 minutes, but who cares? Mm -hmm. yeah, it's out. Mm -hmm. Your mother's fired. Yep. That's some wild shit. They're going to introduce shit. her to some shit called HIPAA. Check this out. Mm. They got you. I don't know what's going on with Jamie because uh, I don't know the word on the Hollywood streets, but uh, we love you. I uh, think it was whack, yo. What? Like, because I believe it was his daughter that put the statement out. Mm -hmm. That was just like, what you was know, that? the blog. Oh, what well, the blog did you got? That was whack. And we fuck with the blog, but we got to just keep it up. I don't fuck with that blog. You fuck with Fee? Oh, they did that first? Yes. Oh, but sometimes they do foul shit. That was wrong. But um, I just think that part was whack. Like, the daughter put the statement out, respect our privacy. You know, he had a health scare. He's currently recovering. Thoughts and prayers, please. And then they were like, all right, since the daughter spoke on it, this is really what happened. Boom. Yeah, I don't like that. That's nasty. Uncalled for. Like, let some people have yo, their Let privacy. people's mm -hmm. medical shit play out in private, yo. Even what y'all doing to Ariana Grande right now. Like, God damn. Hmm. Y'all don't learn a thing, ain't it? Sad, bro. Ariana Grande appears to have lost some weight, and people are going fucking mm -hmm. ballistic, just saying uh, the worst things, the worst things that they could possibly say about her. Yeah. I wasn't aware of that, but yeah, me either. Yeah, it's foul. That's foul. Yeah, yeah, I don't like it. Um, before rest in peace to Majumal, real quick while we're in uh, health shit. He's a jazz pianist oh. that's been sampled. He feeling it is Majumal. Um, I got it. Stakes as high as mm. Majumal. I gave wow. you powers, Majumal. Mm. Wow. Uh, mad, mad classic records came from Majumal. He just passed away. Ninety two, legend, super legend. Mm. Rest yeah, in rest in peace. Rest in peace. Yeah. Nice long life. Yeah, 92. And he, he has some slaps. Word. <laughs> yeah. You about to go and find some more shit. I ain't rapping. I ain't finding shit. <laughs> uh, I want to take this time out to say that this has been the quietest tax season I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> and y'all are going to jail. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Y'all going down. <laughs> y'all think I'm slow? Yeah, they go in the jail. I ain't seen a crab leg you posted. Heard, you ain't heard I ain't seen shit. For yo. months, all winter. Yo. You ain't, oh, I got my tech there. Hey, no, we lit. We outside. <laughs> he ain't been. Hey, niggas ain't even tweeting nothing with that. Start with a T. They ain't tweeting nothing that rhyme with tax. <laughs> So they not in the mall going crazy. I'm out there too. It's just the normal rich white people out there. <laughs> yeah, well, y'all are going to jail. <laughs> they all they got y'all. <laughs> Look, don't get quiet. <laughs> <laughs>
I don't even like this topic. Don't get quiet now. We can move on. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yo, Home sweet. Depot. Psycho. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> you know we leave the streets alone because we don't want no smoke. <laughs> <laughs> leave, leave them boys alone too. Them boys out with no problem. No problem. Crazy. This guy's oh, don't fucking. Talk nah, I was just saying. Speaking of um, going to jail. Yeah, I want I want the uh, court correspondence here, Ice, to break down what's going on with Young Thug. Um, but Mel, well, no, you got the clip for me, right? I got the clip. All right. Let's go. So, I will start by saying that this assertion that I did not mention the four three argument. Don't worry about that, okay? Because it wouldn't be. It, I'd have to do it anyway. So okay. don't even worry about that, okay? Okay. I was just saying that it's just not true. It's, it's, it's cap, to be honest. But um, that aside, though, um, I just, one, like to go back. Hey, fair. So that was one, of, but just for context, that was one of the attorneys in Young Thug's RICO case. So one of the defense attorneys, like part of the team. Right. Yeah, because there's like how many defendants? Like 14? Oh, yes, yeah. I think, yeah, I think it's 14 okay. total. Yeah. So he's one of them, one of the defense attorneys. <laughs> How are you addressing a, a, a judge? Yo, that's cap. Like niggas going nig, man. Guess who going to jail? <laughs> that's that's all funny. I heard. <laughs> that's not funny. <laughs> Nigga, Bro. if your lawyer is it's telling the judge that's slang cap to the judge, that is a bad representation. I don't My nigga, we are on trial for our lives. Word. I don't want to laugh at that, but that is. A I'm bad, not trying to laugh. That is a bad representation of what we are trying to convey. Like dog. Yeah, then yeah, some of his uh, yeah, it's really cap. That's then some of his legal team leave too. They said there was a, a story that some people were leaving. They're cock sources. Oh, and, then, cock and then sources? and then and then and then the, the lawyer also said that um, he could be making more at Chick Fil A than he's making for representing these uh, these defendants. <sighs> like so, it ain't about like he's not even making no money on this. Sounds like it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's it sounds like you get what you pay for. That's cat too, but okay. No, he's probably, he works for the public defender's office, yeah. so he probably isn't making a lot. But that's that's his choice, his decision. He could go out on his own. Hold on, time on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> what? Go back a couple. He works for who? The public defender's office. These niggas got public defenders. So play some the, of them play the drum. I just. Oh. <laughs> <I got you. laughs> Hey, yo, let me tell you something. <laughs> These niggas is not looking at life with the Rico and they got a public defender. Mm. Now it's starting to make sense. Yeah. Hey, yo, what you need me to say? <laughs> <laughs> now, now you see it? Are you serious? No. That's crazy to me. They, they Somebody need to put some money out for these niggas to get some proper representation. They do it to a lot of cases, though. A lot of people in big cases, like... Uh, they freeze your account, so you you could be appointed a public defender. It's a they good point. They, they did that with Preem and Irv Gotti. They froze their account. Preem, they did. They did freeze yeah, all yeah, the murder public defender. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. That is. See how they railroad you when they want to get you. That's, that's crazy. Shit, I ain't think about that. That's a good one right there. I ain't think about that. That's crazy. That's that's, 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 that's playing that's dirty so, right so, there. So then, nigga. who does it though? Like, I think, and I don't want to bring his name up, but like. R. Kelly had a special donate at one point. Remember, like the yeah, lady true, donated, true, 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 true. got the money confiscated. Like yeah. everybody don't got it like that, nigga. I mean, he's in jail for thirty years, but I'm just saying that's like, a good point. No, yeah, I, 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 I stand corrected. R. Kelly is on the end of vibe, saying little Leah got that vibe. <laughs> what you said? Yo, <laughs> yo, what? R. Kelly, the song is she's got that on vibe. The end of uh, his very first single. Featuring a uh, public announcement. And you know, he's singing all the girls' names. And Tasha's a vibe. Kelly's vibe. At the end, he says, Little Aaliyah is a vibe. She probably was 14 at the time. But we just know, way younger than 14. Maybe 13. At vibe? Vibe is you know 90, 91. <gasps> Do you not have to play it? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoops, whoops, whoops. You do whoops, not whoops, have to play it. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds yeah. crazy. That's crazy. I ain't even. I never played yes. that one. Oh yeah, I, yeah. yeah. I mean, we can't play that part if you want to play no, that. No, part. no, 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 no. Take no, 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 no. our word for it. Yeah, we don't, we don't, you I want to hear it now. Music <laughs> aficionado, I'm gonna take your word for yeah. it, brother. Uh, I am. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's there. Playing today, they That's almost crazy. dropped the beat out. 
Yeah. It's there to hear. Yeah. Just crazy to think that first single, you was on it's that. your first single. Okay. That's before we was even the RR. That's a fucking. That's that was when he was rip. with Robert. public announcement. Yeah, yeah that's. He mm-hmm. called himself the Pied Piper. I know. Sicko. I know. Hey, mm-hmm. speaking of sickos, uh, Marcus Houston says that he doesn't fuck with women his age <sighs> because they come with baggage and they have kids. <laughs> he says the younger they are, you can mold them and. Oh, it is no. stop. Oh don't, my God! Jo- Joe Sauce grooming says, don't do that. predators talk. Jesus. I'm Joe sorry. Sauce says stop. No, it's, it's, no, it's he's it's giving true. interviews. He said that. He's doing interviews. He's, press runs. He said you could do what with them? He's he's saying that younger, mold them. Yes. He's on a nasty press yeah. row. Yo. He said the girls his age, he don't be liking their attitude. <laughs> my 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 my. Damn! What the fuck? These niggas is nasty, bro. Yo, y'all don't have to share Sickles. everything. I agree. Yo, when y'all go do the press run, stick to the points that the you, the publicists and the company are highlighting. Nah, you know what I think happens? Drive those five points home and don't talk about nothing else. I think these niggas got so comfortable doing True. it and getting away with it for so long that it's Say just it's second nature now. Now it's just like, oh yeah, they don't even think they're saying nothing wrong. So it's not a crime, but morally it's wrong, right? So I think that's the angle that he's going to. Like, I didn't do nothing illegal. Again, that's so my whole that's my whole seventeen eighteen. Morally, that's my whole seventeen eighteen argument. Yeah, morally is wrong. It's disgusting. Yeah, you wait the one day, now it's legal. Mm-hmm. It's it's just bullshit. Nastiness. It's bullshit. He wants to stand on the square to show that or make it seem like that he's not as guilty as these niggas any be taking the people. press run for positivity. Yeah. Nigga, they putting you on a press run so you could come up here and say some stupid shit, mm. some more shit to get us popping. Dodo. But again, some of these niggas be so thirsty for it, I take it. Sure. Like, nobody's saying my name in nothing. Mm-hmm. Now, look, mm-hmm. here we are on this platform. We done said his name twice. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, he really wanted us to believe that he waited till she turned 18 yeah. the next day. <sighs> okay. Yeah. I know. I know. Yeah. Also, while we're here, uh, Florida will now require rape and incest victims to show documents to prove that they were raped. If they cannot provide them, the government will mandate mandate they give birth to their rapist child. So what do what is it? What is the proof expected? Like what? How, I want to see what the burden of proof is. So like somebody breaks. Yeah, I raped the dog. Somebody, I'm gonna sign on the dotted line. Exactly. Like, hey, can you can you sign this? To let everybody know that you did in fact rape me and that this wasn't consensual. Like, mm. okay, here here's the proof in order. Bro, every time Florida come up in the news, I, I flash back to that Bugs Bunny cartoon where he had the saw. And he was just cutting off Florida, and it's just like, just, just let that go. <laughs> like, bro, they just be on some, what the fuck is going on down there? They hire some fucked up politicians. Yeah. Or Every elect, time, I it's just say. like, you know what's crazy, though? Women be voting for that shit. Like, yo, dog, that shit has to go to a vote. Mm-hmm. And some of these women will stand in their party so strongly that they'll vote for whatever the party is dictating. Like, fuck are you talking about? Yeah, it's a Christian, super duper red, you mm-hmm. know. Disgusting. That's not Christianity. Right I know name. it's not. Like, that is not. crazy, B. You Sick. know what I'm saying? Sick. Yo, I got to have proof that I got raped. He going to be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. What you need? You need ID too? Like, what the fuck are you talking about? That shit is crazy. Sicko. True indeed. Anything in music? We did. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah, you fucked me up with that <laughs> one. Yo, yeah. I was talking. We ain't talked about I mean, music. more positive news. Uh, Meek Mill and Robert Kraft are marching for anti-Semitism in Poland uh, th- this this <laughs> this month. You know, it's interesting. I've seen a lot of. <laughs> Talk that shit, me. Get them niggas, me. Tell me, tell me more. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Me tell me Come more. On. There's a, uh, they're, 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 they're marching, man. <laughs> that, there's that much other story to it. <laughs> Apparently, Robert, he, he reached, uh, Meek reached out to Robert Kraft and said, "What well, more can I do to help?" And Robert Kraft said, "You know what? I got something for you. Come, come march. Come march with me in Poland. And if I'm Meek, in I'm Poland. on that jet going right to Poland. Hmm. Let's talk about that. I'm going. Tell me why." <laughs> <laughs> because me allegedly, when Meek, nah, allegedly when Meek needed help, Robert Kraft was there to help him. 
So if you need help, I'm going to extend the same exact courtesy that you extended to me for life. If it ain't hurting me. Robert, like, Robert Kraft is a good person to have on speed dial. Like, how you need my help? You need me to, you want, do, to do anything? You need right. me to support anything you let, got going let, on? I don't try to put my fucking moral beliefs on, on anybody else. Bro, listen. If a nigga asks for help that need help and is not going to be of a hindrance to me, why well, say no? Niggas be only shit. I don't know if you're asking me. No, I'm serious. Like, I believe that with any... Like, if you call me and say, y'all need you to do X, Y, Z. If, I, if I'm not going to be compromised, or even sometimes if I am compromised, I can look at I, it I'll like have a, to wait. But I can look at it like... That's where we're going to disagree a little bit. I can look at it like it's a hindrance to me. If I'm taking time out of every other month or a lot of time out, especially when football season starts, and we're in the off season and, and this is going on. Mm-hmm. So we're seeing me come out a lot in support of... The billionaire people got you, but that don't necessarily mean it's a hindrance. Mm-hmm. I said, depending on how you look at that, if he starts to look at that like, "Hey, I could be using this time constructively on some of my own shit," then he could look at it like a hindrance, and then that answer is going to go a little different when you call and say, "Hey, can you go to Poland right quick?" No, nigga, I can't. But I just pulled you into this million dollar company over here doing blah 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 blah. Mm-hmm. I ain't had to pick up the phone. I called you to bring you in over here when I didn't have to. to bring me into what? See, and that's where our fight is gonna come no. in too. Most of these niggas like to hang out with billionaire niggas. I'm not dumb. I'm not, Most of the girls I'm like to not. fuck let me talk. Most of the girls like to fuck the billionaires without getting a dime from them. True, true, true. No, I'm, I'm not one of them. We're not having that conversation. I'm talking about, let's say, like what what was the shit that they announced with the new era? They bought Mitchell and S or New Era or some shit? Um, I think Mitchell and us, I Mitchell think they nice. bought who? Meek, um, Meek, the dude from the Sixers. Michael all Rubin. Them, Michael See, I don't, I don't want to hear about none of that. I'm giving you an example. I'm just using that as an example. So let's just say I got bought into that, mm. right? Like they ain't, they had enough money to buy the shit on their own. They might have gave me a piece of that. So now when Michael Rubin calls my phone and he needs some assistance, I'm there. I'm not assuming who had the money to do what, gotcha. especially with entertainers. I'm not talking about the sports people. True. Sure. So when people just continue to show up in support of, hey, if that's cool for you, it's cool for you. I'm only speaking for me. Gotcha. At some point, if I think I'm worth what I'm worth, if the relationship ain't a business in some type of way, Mm -hmm. like I understand you got me out of jail, thanks. I done showed up for a few years at a bunch of Sixers games, Patriots games. I done tweeted some shit. I done been in this meeting. I done been in over here. I done been in over here. Still got to sell his house. Well, in Meek's defense, uh, Kraft is... Apparently launched a twenty-five million dollar stand-up to Jewish hate campaign, so there may be some. See, you want your name to be involved with there that. There may be. Yeah, you yeah, want your and, name to be involved. And Mike Tyson's also involved. Apparently, Tom Brady, John you want Bon Jovi, your name like with that. yeah. But my, I my, a funny my statement still stands outside yeah. of that, though. Amazingly funny. But that's dope. <laughs> you asked, you asked, were there any music news? Um, the AI out here putting out some heat. That's what I heard. Moves. Told y'all. I heard it. The AI. I heard it. The AI dropped uh, uh, Drake. The AI dropped. The AI. <laughs> the, the, AI. AI. the AI. I don't even know how to, <laughs> it, I don't even know how to explain that shit. The Word. AI dropped. Word. This nigga with the so sheet and the dude, glasses, right? A dude, yeah, his name was uh, Ghost Rider or something. He he used, the, used AI Sorry, to create a record by Drake featuring The Weeknd. With production sounding like it was Metro. All constructed by artificial intelligence. None of the artists, the producer, no one had anything to do with the song. And I was like, that's some bullshit. And then I heard it. I got it. Play it. Let her rip. Let her rip. Now, a lot of people said that this is heat. It's heat to me. I prefer my music from humans, but I do understand. I can see that thing bouncing and starting <laughs> right now. No, 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 it ain't been six months, or maybe six months. Bro, I was just reading. That's scary. Scientists are saying that by the end of this year, and this is what I've been 
saying where all this AI shit was going. I love when black people start talking about what the scientists Science. are saying. Hey, I, I, mean, I like to hear <laughs> what the scientists say. But scientists are saying that by the end of this year, you will be able to upload your deceased loved ones. Yeah. Make and that make sense. Say more words. So they were instructing people to kind of keep, take a bunch of pictures and videos. Got it. Got of, it. Of, mm-hmm. Got it. You know, Voicemail. Voicemails, yeah. all of that. Yeah. So we spoke about this a while ago where they were saying you could have, like if you have a bunch of voicemails or, or audio recordings of someone, they were able to implement it into like a, a teddy bear or something and actually have them. Oh my them God. That's, what, Kanye, that's what Kanye did for Kim, right? Alexa, all of that. When he, she, he had the uh, hologram of her dad. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. Mm-hmm. So he used to smoke them gifts all for her to go get fucked by P. Davidson. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> it's the small things. <laughs> That's why I don't give good gifts no more. <laughs> <laughs> but they don't matter. <laughs> they don't matter. <laughs> At all. So, so like, uh, Mel, where it's going is, like, if you lose someone, mm-hmm. they're saying that by the time they got this shit perfected, you really won't lose them. And that's where it gets tricky. Like, you will be able to <laughs> literally sit down and have a conversation with that loved one that you want, and they'll be able to pull so much from them that it'll... That's, such, that's it, fucking insane. I, it sound, it's so, it, it's, it that sounds is so insane, but... Fucking wrong. I don't think so. I'm on the other side of this. Wow, there's a lot. There's a lot of people that... Miss loved ones and I, it's want. not it's not just about like it's not just about missing someone. It's it's losing some people when they lose a loved one, they lose some of themselves. I, you, so I, tr- I, I know I'm trying not I, I know. I know. I know. Yeah. But <laughs> Yo. I'm trying not Hey to, scammers. <laughs> get ready. <laughs> we fucking got it. No, you ain't hear what they said too. The scammers. <laughs> They said, I am your uncle dinner. <laughs> <laughs> they said, yo, dog, now you got to start giving your mother you and your, grand- her. your grandparents <laughs> and them a code word because they're saying with the AI, they're going to start getting your voice. And it's like if you called your mom right, I saw it. and said, Ma, yo, they got me in such and such. I, I need it you happened. to wire me some money. I know. Blah, that's blah, what blah, blah, blah. He's just mm-hmm. repeating it. But. Using, using the, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Some the, Your loved one's voice. Mm-hmm. Your grandparents going to be like, yeah. Y'all need to send a check to Y'all grandparents broke Nigga y'all dead <laughs> <laughs> The fuck is you talking about? Your grandparents don't <laughs> love, love y'all Like you think they love mm-hmm. y'all No no your grandparents got fucked up <laughs> yeah, And yeah, yeah, look uh, This is from German photographer Boris Eldigzen Is refusing a prestigious award For his photog- photography After revealing The prize winning image Was made using AI According to the Independent UK, Eldigan turned down a prestigious prize after revealing that his winning photo- uh, photograph was created using artificial intelligence. However, one week after he won the prize, he shared a statement on his website announcing that he would not accept the awards. He said it was designed to provoke debate. I applied as a cheeky monkey to find out if the competitions are prepared for AI images to enter, and they are not. Mm. We, the photo world, need an open discussion. What's a cheeky monkey? I don't know. That's, sound racist to me. No, right? well, Sorry, you know, some, some some European European I'll let it slide. Like, a cheeky. cheeky monkey is my little viral pic that, that went out. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> See? See? Yeah. See? <laughs> a cheeky monkey. Yo, y'all playing. Yeah. But a few niggas. <laughs> Your DMs must have been lit. Yo, yeah. they was like, you, Joe, Joe, Joe ben was wearing his fucking. Fuck what y'all talking about. His, that nigga is fine. All your thoughts. Hey. In your pony printers. Oh man, that's how your weekend was. <laughs> <laughs> no, my weekend had nothing to do with this. I didn't even look at all you that. Ask about how weekend was, and you usually do because you were in a rush. I did ask. Game. No, you didn't. Yeah, you did. I did. I took smash therapy this weekend. What? Yeah, raise up. Uh, 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 in a, in rage room. A, yeah, rage room. In Amazing. BX. Amazing. Smash therapy. You know, I'm, uh, got all my anger out. Oh, I wanted to do that. I want you to come. Yeah, Did you cry? Yeah. No, I didn't cry. I was just thinking about some people and, you know what I mean? What'd you break? Uh, TVs, computers. Shout out to my mm. man Q Vessel. You know what I mean? Sean. But it was good. It felt good. I'm going to bring you. Out I got to shout them out. That's you said, Don't shout nobody else out, I said. That's it. All right, but I want just you to come. Q Vessel and Sean. I'm a- I got another name. Shout out to Joe. Well, that works. Yeah, I, want, <laughs> man, I, I would like to invite you, man. I'm going back this weekend. One thousand percent. Yeah, I want you to come too, bro. For real, it's on me. I'm there. Ice, right, you too, please. 
That's it's on you. I've been home all week trying to calculate how much you make now. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you doing I've been that? home all week because you showed me that thing and you was like, nah, that's just the first half. Then I was like, wait, times two. <laughs> wait. Then I was like, times that by... Uh, you, you got me. No, <laughs> you, you fucking got me. The people were saying I got you. We, the people. I didn't, yeah. I didn't really get you. We though. got him. We you got me. Now you got my man Corey. Look, I, 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 now Corey, your man. <laughs> now your man. Oh, now Corey, your man. I know. Oh, That's man. Yeah, y'all are too funny. I care with y'all. You be getting it. Nah, I, I'm trying to get back to where I was at. Yo. Here's something else that's pretty funny, and then we can move on. What's up? There's a large group of people out there complaining about the prices at Moneybag Yo's new restaurant that he opened out there in Memphis. I want to repeat this for y'all. Y'all complaining about prices at Moneybag Yo's restaurant. I repeat, this person's name it is in fact <laughs> money, money bag, bag yo. yo got it but you see what they're complaining about yeah you know black people don't know what a la carte mean the niggas don't know what a tomahawk steak is oh that's hilarious that's what they're complaining about mm. the tomahawk is a hundred dollars uh, 135 yeah. 135 excuse me about 35 excuse 135 me. for yeah. a tomahawk you don't no, eat steak that's steak. a fake tomahawk no it's not no that, that's what it started at 135 but that's my point like yeah I'm big a fucking tomahawk six and seven hundred dollars at certain restaurants in new jersey okay okay well, well we're in talking new about we're not talking about the 24 karat gold one i got my man like that yeah i'm gonna say okay this thing is stunting too hard word i don't eat that but I, anyway, go ahead. Just, <laughs> wait, something looks different about you. You look good. Yeah. Is it the hair? No. It's not this outfit. I've seen this outfit many times on him. You didn't. But go ahead. See, look. Asshole. <laughs> <laughs> we got him. 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 It's not the one. It's a new hoodie. What is it? Mm-hmm. Melissa, what, you see, notice anything different? He lost now? weight. Yo, leave me alone, my nigga. You lost weight, itch. Oh, you lost. Yo, dog, because you keep pushing You with lost you. a lot of weight. Time a hawk, nigga. Salute, salute. Money back, yo. <laughs> How you did it, You lost huh? a lot of weight. Okay, I'm giving you credit no, for losing weight, gang. Hey, yo, dog. <laughs> What? Yo, I got two, I got two of those needles. I got two I'm, of those. I'm dead. I'm not even joking. Hey, yo, and man, I got two of those needle things too. They made in Canada. The, the diabetes joint. I got two of them. I give you one. Yo, yo, you did. Yo, you looking good. You do. You what lost waist? a lot of weight. Yo, Tomahawk. Yo, give me five of <laughs> those. Yo, give me name five of the episode. Man, Tomahawk. Yo, move your fucking stubby knuckles out my face. Oh, yo. You, fat, you lost weight. You fat shaming niggas. No, it's funny because I was here with him a few years. Yeah, a few years ago, he wanted to go on this body journey oh, and man. he was failing at it. Oh, bro. And then me and Ice was making jokes like, ah, nigga, you can't lose weight. Ah, ah, ah. And then Simba came here and then he, and then Procrasti- once Simba <laughs> left. His procrastination once, turned into happened. determination. I, I'm just saying, Simba well, was my motivation. Little, little, little pressure was applied. All I'm saying was little, little since, okay. since that Simba episode, you have lost what has to be 17, 18 pounds. <laughs> you look good. It's almost like you've been wearing a fat suit. You've been jogging around your house ever since that, that Simba episode. He has or, eight. Or, or, he has eight since then. I was getting ready to say, sometimes yeah. you be a little stressed. stressed. I'm taking the pills. Is it, hold on, no, no, a little stressed to do that. AI-ish? <laughs> oh, shit, what's the code word? That might what's be the AI-ish. password? <laughs> yeah. Procrastination turned to determination when oh, Simba came. Man. That's what happened. Look, 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 smile and hold to the chin. I'm hating. This guy's a fool, yo. You look good. Congratulations. Did you get those flowers? Hmm? What? Did you get the flowers? What flowers? Those flowers. They're right there. Right there. The, the box. In the black bag. The black bag. Right black. Black. there. Uh, I did. What? I'll go get them for you. I got you. Did you see them? You didn't even know they were I there? I did not know that they were there. Are you serious? I, on, I had no idea that they were there. You didn't know that there's something those, up there for Those you? flowers no. are for you. See, earlier when we was talking about it, they was making a joke. But I said for Mel. I wasn't trying to say I bought them for Mel. I was trying to say those flowers are for Mel. Yeah, no, I was completely clueless because I... Uh, I just bring Mel her flowers, please. Uh, that, those are the expensive flowers. Word. Now, these are Venus. I, oh, I love Venus. We know. I love Venus flowers. Now you Shout out, out to Big Ice. Pass me that little cart, that Can little paper little on the side of it, please. The, the bag is right Pass there. We're going to look too hard. There you go. We got you. What? We got him. We fucking got him. Is there a little yeah. card in there? 
Well, let's see. Let's open them up first. I want to slap that shit out here. The blue joints, eh? Huh? <laughs> you know what I mean? Wow. That shit's look fire. The little royal blues? That blue is, that blue is bluing. And, we, and she's wearing blue today? And we what? also have a little gift message here that says, <laughs> it's only been one week, but it feels like forever. Forever. Eternity. I'll let you read the name so you know who sent these up here. Ooh. And then just to make sure you got them, I received a text while we were recording. Oh, wait, was it? Oh, oh my bad. shit. Uh, I thought that was my bad. You thought ice, what? Ice moved because he's losing more weight right now. <laughs> <laughs> he's lo Ish is losing even more weight. Look at the pounds flying. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Damn. Just, Damn. Just, just the pounds are just tripping. <laughs> when that rotisserie chicken uh, shit be yeah, spinning yeah, into the yeah, <laughs> God no. damn. Oh, man. Ish, you've been working with Mel all this time. You never did that. <laughs> did what? Bought the expensive flowers. Oh. Can you say? Cheap ones either. <laughs> oh. Those are the ones that last for years. It says they're from Simba. <laughs> she sung his name. It's that voice you brought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. S -s 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 Simba. That was like the Janet Jackson wow. prom voice. You just right stole there. my idea, gang. <laughs> Get out my brain, bro. Me? Yeah, S -s 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 Simba. S -s 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 Simba. <laughs> thief. Look, idea thief. Uh -huh. You view babies is ridiculous. All right, babies. listen. I want to pull up. Uh, I want to pull up this uh, part of the show. There's a few of them here, and I'm just gonna read them off, and we'll have a little bit of fun. Copy. Okay. Rapid fire style. Yes, my favorite. Curtis says. Signing Kurt. Oh, Curtis wants to write. I hate when niggas want to make me read. <laughs> hey, fellas and Mel. So um, I want to ask questions, but it seems the only ones that make it through are these sucker duck ass losers <laughs> with relationship problems. And quite frankly, I'm too lit to have issues. <laughs> Yo, talk that shit, Kurt Flirt. Let's go, big Kurt. Let's go, Kurt Flirt. But seriously, my question is: How would you guys go about telling you your girls that you want to sleep with other people, but you are in fact committed to her and your family? I don't want a relationship with anyone else. I just want to be able to, you know, Mel. Could you be in an open relationship at this point? Like if, oh, he's, he's, now you're starting trouble. Like if Ish and his girl wanted you to join <laughs> as the second girlfriend, would you be down? I know Simba put the pressure, Damn, but just wow. forget that for one second. Oh, this nigga got jokes. <laughs> Love the show, you guys. Mel, keep the entertainment going. I'll let y'all have that one without me. <laughs> that was a mouthful. Um... Pause. Could I be in an open relationship? I mean, what's good for the goose is good for the gander type thing. I, I don't mean, know what that means. Meaning, like, if you're going to go out and if, fuck if other chicks, your... like, I'm going to go get some extra peen. Are we good with that? You have, bro. I'm finding one peen. You I know. I, I do. <laughs> I, I do. Yeah. So, anyways, but theoretically, hypothetically speaking. That's not what he's saying, though. I know he's not saying that, but I'm posing the question back at him. Like, oh, well, if, 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 <laughs> if she no, no. <laughs> approach her with that shit. Now, I'm sorry, I'm now, sorry. Now, now it's just the part of the part of the show translator, right? Yeah, this no, guy. he's saying a little bit more than that. I think it's loaded. It's specific. twofold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet it is. I, I couldn't personally. Yeah. No, I'm not doing no push. No. Mm -mm. I couldn't be in an open relationship with somebody that I care I, about. I'm a, no. But if you don't, this is gonna sound them, terrible. You, you, you don't mind. If I don't care about them, then I'm, I'm probably just I'm, just I'm probably just dating them. All right, yeah. I'm yes. just gonna yeah. keep going because you got it boring. Danny Hudson <laughs> just cheat. Recently started watching <laughs> Accused. Thanks for the plug, and wanted to ask: Would your partner's medical and mental family history be a deal breaker when deciding to procreate, mm. and mm. should it be discussed? Ooh. If you really love a person, should it matter? A thousand Should? percent. Absolutely. And does. A lot of people don't that was, answer that, that part. Was, that's a very good question. So you guys want to know a little scientific fact? Shoot. Sure. Okay. The scientists said. Scientists say. There we go. Yes. They deduce that the sense that is the most important to human beings in terms of procreation is smell. And they say that because apparently our immune systems communicate with each other through smell. So if you ever met somebody that was like bad as fuck, like just everything just was firing in all cylinders, 
but the smell was just off. Not like, you know, bad B.O. or, you know, fishy pussy or whatever the fuck. I'm talking about like just a weird, it doesn't jam with you kind yeah. of smell, right? Yes. Mm-hmm. That, that was happened. your immune system saying, don't pro- procreate with this motherfucker. Mm-hmm. I think that's really important, wow. says the person who didn't have any kids. <laughs> 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 smell like seaweed. I can't bust in you, my mom. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Them two are the worst. <laughs> I'm trying not to laugh, man. Ooh. Yo, you was playing. Why? <laughs> I didn't even say nothing. I see you. I can see you two niggas. So you were staring at him. <laughs> like, what the fuck? That shit made me laugh. He was like this. <laughs> really, man? Hey, yo. She don't smell right. You That's your news. You like that. Why did you laugh? <laughs> did you go, hey, man? Says the girl with her kids. Oh, why? But I, <laughs> well, I want to look that up. Is that, is that, we gotta look, that's true? They said that for real? That's, yeah. Shit. That's not the only fan scientist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you need your smell. I know. Oh, man. That's the most important. I, I'm going to go with dick. <laughs> okay, so what do you guys think? Do you think it's important to have the conversations about yes. you know, family Absolutely. history, medical history? Yeah. I think people should. But I, th- I, don't I don't think, think it happens. We, do when you, we don't. We don't. We and don't. when you open it's up to somebody. Yo. Yeah. It's embarrassing, too. Not just that. Like, if somebody in your family have um, mental issues, we look at that, especially in the black community, like that's a vulnerability or a slight. So we don't really be having those. We'll talk about and that. And they be hiding them from you for yeah, the yeah, first couple of years. That's what he's saying. They yeah. hide Yeah, that's yeah. What I mean. You're right. Like they somebody. Hide they hide them. Where your brother at? I thought you had a brother. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> I thought it was three of you. Yo, your oh. brother showed up. Yo, stop. <laughs> Yo, you can't. We can't do it. Separate the goddamn drug. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, see? Don't, don't, don't. Write that down. 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 Write that they be hiding their family in the room. <laughs> nah, that's real. Yeah, nah, that is real though. Yeah, that one room back there, the door stay closed. Every time you come over, yo, where's that? It's by the bathroom. <laughs> don't go in. Don't go in that room. You go to the bathroom, be a plate on the floor. <laughs> yo. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, shit. JBP, JBP, oh, where would you be without the JBP? Oh, man. I hope we helped you out. Uh, <laughs> no. Yeah, just check for closed doors. Yeah, dog. <laughs> Yo, what's going on? Here? How much niggas going really if you have that conversation? They start talking. You can hear them trying to talk to you while you're pissing. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> like, hey, I heard something scratching oh. while I was peeing. Like, Yo, you got a cat. <laughs> Don't go there, Joe. I see where you're going. <laughs> Try to talk to the, try to talk to the door. Still the radiator. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I don't stand with this. I don't stand with this. Y'all making fun. Nah, I don't stand with that. Stop. You gotta go to the wall. <laughs> <laughs> Just knock it on the wall. <laughs> Box. Oh, man. Look at you heard that? Paul. He's talking about. It'd be a plate of food on the floor. <laughs> but it being like a cat food bowl. Like, that's, that's yeah. getting fucked up. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's one of the trains yeah. from high school and yeah. shit. Yeah. It'd be fucked up. Yeah. Well, when you got a cat, I've known you my whole life. <laughs> Yo. Oh, oh man. Right, bro. Yes. Like, bro, no, it really, they do. The like, light bulb be out back there. Oh, but let me ask a question, though. How many is like, this? Like, if, you, if you really into Vines the girl. Vines growing out the door. Hold on, wait. If you really into the girl. Pussy good, you in the, y'all vibing. And then you find out like months down the line, are you gonna stop fucking with her? Find, out, we, that, find that out what? She, find out what? That, that she has, in a family? Cr- you a know, family, family members. Of mental illness. A mental illness. You I ain't trying house, to procreate anyway. See, so mom, no. Hold on. I don't say that. He you shooting shit no. the first day. Fam, I am clipped. He snapped. You talking about you see the family, man? I thought a few of my bitches were slow. <laughs> oh, shit. And you still went for it. <laughs> 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 I thought I had the advantage. Oh. <laughs> hey. Yo, you hear me? Hey, you get hey. wrong? Hey, 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 Joe. And they, Yo. they, 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 you know, the, the, the fire. 
Yeah. 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 Random outburst like, shit. Like, yo, I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> tomato soup. You be like, what? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> they get mad, start shit. cutting shit. Oh, they, yeah, yeah, yeah. man. Yeah. They about to watch a movie. So. <laughs> My Aunt Tammy was very mean to me, growing up. It's like, oh, shit, bitch. <laughs> I unlocked some shit. I thought, yeah, what? So he's about to fuck. What are you talking about? You, and you still try to beat him. <laughs> you still a beat. Word, Tammy. What did Aunt Tammy do? Word, Aunt Tammy do? What did Aunt Tammy do? Yeah. <laughs> fucked up, hey, yo. Okay. Tammy. It's on Tammy, okay? Oh, man. Yeah, that's how oh, I start man. right there. Oh, hey, you ain't hot, you'll take this <laughs> off. Where I tell me, take That's sympathy this. pussy. That's <laughs> easy. Mm-hmm. Easy. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. Oh. Y'all ain't right, yo. We not de- Are we deleting this? <laughs> this we went. <laughs> Y'all went too far. Let's be the niggas. <laughs> you be go. No stop now. <laughs> you, you go to the supermarket with your your girl and her brother or some shit. <laughs> you get out, she lead a nigga in there, windows up. You be like, yo, you don't wanna she took the key out. <laughs> like, yo, you don't wanna you don't wanna bring a little Tommy? <laughs> nah, he good. Nah, little nigga be in there like Kevin Quirk. Nah, that nigga's too far. Sick fucks. <laughs> Yo, Mel, we don't stand with this. We don't stand with this. I am looking at them with the side. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah, something's wrong with yeah, them. Yeah, but hold on. Yeah. When you was young and she had to watch her brother. I forget it. Right, that's exactly. Fun. You she go right to- over there. She had to watch her brother. And you beat, too. You beat. Are we looking for sleepers? Is that- <laughs> <laughs> have y'all gotten all of this out of your... It's fight weekend. We ain't, talk- we ain't talking about the fights. We have not. And we ain't talking about the playoffs. We ain't talking about nothing. We ain't talking about the session. We ain't stupid. But yo, so y'all I- still watching that shit after nigga dying? Hell yeah. yeah. Hell nigga, yeah. it's turned up now. Yeah, now it's, now it's the beef. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. Now it's scrapping. For yeah. the succession. Everyone's scrapping, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Your man Tom. You didn't piece that together, ish. Yeah. Your man Thanks. Tom gonna hit you <laughs> hit you <to> whoever. <laughs> whoever. <laughs> nigga stupid, yo. What's <laughs> wrong with this dummy? You can't dumb it. For the succession. <laughs> you said you stopped watching, goofy. I'm joking. Oh, <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, shit. <laughs> I don't watch that shit. You don't watch it? Oh. Nah, now the real beef, like, now you see um, the, the siblings all. Everybody's yeah. jockeying for position. Correct. Yeah, everybody wants it. to know who's going to run the company now mm-hmm. that Logan's dead. And everybody is freaking the fuck out because and they're trying to jockey for position. Like, Tom, everyone's trying to figure out where do I fit in? Like, what's my best bet? Exactly. Cousin uh-huh. Greg. Oh, did you see the scene, though, with the with Carrie, the girlfriend? Oh, that was sad. She had her shit packed up in a plastic so fucking yo, yo, bag. Shit right, yeah, yeah, shit right there. Yeah, yeah. No, no, you can't go upstairs. <laughs> Shit. Get to, and, and take her out through the back. Yo. And then she whispered to like Roman. She was just like, so y'all doing spoiler sh- alerts again. Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry. Spoiler, spoiler alerts. Yeah. I mean, y'all It's not for know. y'all to do every episode of Succession for the okay. remainder. This is episode four, and y'all okay. are spoiling everything. It's, I mean, this is. Yeah. This is great. Yeah. Just, how, how many seasons? This is this, is, this fourth, fourth and last season. Four, yeah. It's okay. over. Yeah. After this. Yeah. What, what platform is it on? HBO. HBO. Yeah. Okay. But it's it's um it's an amazing show though. Like, it is. Um, also, well, we we'll, we won't spoil no more Succession. So watch it. Um, like you said, it's fight week. So yes, uh, Devontae Davis, and he was on Kai Sinat's, uh stream, and they pulled in what's the, the dude he fighting? Um, Garcia. 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 They pulled him in there, really, and he was like, "Yo, let's bet it." Winner take all. Bet your purse, my purse. Winner take all. He was like, yo, let's bet it. He's like, yo, I'll draw it up. Let's get it drawn up. And, and whoever win, get the whole shit. That's that, crazy. That's different. I don't think that shit happened. Cap. That's lying. That is cap. <laughs> Nigga, the promoters heard that shit. And it's cap. Hey, the ratings. Fuck out of here. Yeah, that's cap. That's not happening. But it's cap. It was dope to see, though. That would be fire. If they could do it. Nigga, put their heart on that camera. I don't think it's going to be a, a long fight. I don't think so. You don't think so, right? I don't think it's going to be I thought about it, fight. too. I thought I about it, too, when I was driving here. Like, is it going to be low? Like, they're doing all this popping up everywhere, promoting Kostanai, trying to conjure up fucking fake things. I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. I think that... 
You got take. You got take one in jail. Yeah. Okay. You got take one. Everybody got take yes. one. Yes. Yeah. Okay. For sure. For sure. For and sure. I'm still stopping. Well, you think I'm, I'm, I'm watching it though? That's, I'm, I'm, I'm watching it. I'm watching it. Sure. Is we gonna be at age? I'm coming to see you. I got me winning that night, depending on who are out there. Now that's gonna be a big fight though. Is this one of them ones though? Is this one of them like mega fights? They both hit hard, yo. Super hard. I don't know if um, Ryan Garcia, I, I mean, Garcia be leaving himself open too much. Yeah, like, I thought about that too. But he hit hard, dog. He fast as shit. He's fast as shit, yo. You don't even see that shit coming. He be knocking niggas out. I think Tate gonna beat him, though, but um, I think it's gonna be a better fight than we giving it credit for. It you might think, not be that fast. Do you think um, it'll go the distance and, and be a decision? Nah, or they not? both hit hard, yeah. yo. They both hit hard. I don't think it'll go the full distance, but... I don't think it's gonna be no three, can, four can round. It, shit. I'm tired of paying top dollars and that shit in like the first round, nigga. You be hype, yeah, get in the wings. Let me get some wings. Let me. Get, you be in the bar. <laughs> and by the time this shit comes, it's over. Tonight, the Snowfall series finale. Yeah. Yes. Again, yeah, round of applause for all characters, all the amazing actors, all the behind the scenes people of Snowfall on a phenomenal run. Thank you. We appreciate that. I'm caught up. Mel says she caught okay. up. Yeah. You did that shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thoughts? Uh, I told Joe this when I walked in. I think you guys were tripping saying that season five was shit. It uh, was... That shit was terrible. Yeah, it was... It was the worst. It, okay. What? Compared to the other seasons? Right. No, not, That's the problem. Not comparing. I think well, that... Well, like artistic shit? A little. A little. I think that it That's was... That's your bag, though. Yeah, I think so it you, was... You appreciate I, it a little I think it was like a character-building season just to see... Huh. Just to see how far the moral degradation went in each of them, not just Franklin, not not just Jerome and not just Louis, but also his mom. You know what I mean? Like how it just its tentacles just have uh, such a far reaching capacity. That's what I saw. Of course, I was able to binge from like season four and then through That's season five yeah, and then yeah, getting yeah. into season six. The storyline was very consistent and I saw how it was like, you know, the pieces of the puzzle fell into place. And I think the season five offered like some humor, you know, the fucking tiger shit. Yeah. That shit was. None of us were laughing. The acid. Yeah, acid see, in real time, nobody laughed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. When you're, when you're waiting for all. a week and that shit popped up, yeah. it was like, bruh. Understood. It, Understood. It, but when you're watching it and you're just, it's like death, death, carnage, death. Death, carnage, crackheads, and shit like that, and so we gonna let the government tiger. fucking you. She wasn't mad at the tiger. We're gonna let the tiger get a shot at the death and carnage. She wasn't right. mad at the but tiger. But the shit was, the shit was, it was, it was their version of comedy in a in a dark show. You know what I mean? That, and then also Scully dosing the wedding with LSD. In I like that episode. Me too. Yeah. I, liked I, that. That I yeah. like that episode. I like that episode. I thought that episode I think, was hilarious. I think the self-reflection when he was hallucinating yeah. had an underlying yeah. meaning. I like that. I like that episode. I agree with that scene, but yeah. I did not like that. I, I like that episode. episode. Yeah. And then Peaches. Like, that shit just kind of threw me for a loop. You know, like, the whole robbery thing. It just, it's, it's fucked. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, tonight is the finale mm -hmm. of the series. Predictions? Hope, I hope they go out. I don't, I don't care. If it, I, last yeah. week I was fine. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't know. care. Any prediction? I don't even have it. I don't, I don't have know. one. Yeah, I don't know. Like that's the dope shit. That somebody will die. It's unpredictable. Facts. Somebody will die. Somebody my, my prediction is somebody will you die. You still rolling with Leon? Yeah, I'm thinking Leon dying. Okay. I think Teddy's going. Y'all watch Dave or no? Ted, you think what? What? Wait, what? I think Teddy's going. Teddy dead. He died. Wait, wait, no. Wait, no. Wait, 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 wait. What? How did last episode end? Teddy died. Oh yeah, the mom <laughs> yeah. got killed. We was Duh. mad at the mother for that bullshit. Oh, see, I'm good now. I don't care. I don't care. That could have ended it right there. Fair. It's over for me. Like, they just got to tie up their little loose ends, say goodbye to us, chef's kiss, Man. and, and mm. I'll tip my hat to them. True. Um, what are you saying? So you watch Dave? Anybody here watch Dave? Uh, I used to watch Dave. That is a great show, yo. I didn't get it. I it was great. great show. I, I just didn't. It's back. It's great. Back into it. Still great. Still great. The tour, they had a tour episode where he wound up with some random girl at her house on a tour. And then shit went left, like, just shit you could relate to being in the music business. And there's an episode where uh, Rick Ross lets him hold his chain, and he ends up walking out the club with it, and then he gets robbed for it. It's, it's dope shit, man. They're killing it. Mm. They're I'll killing it. it. That's a great How show, many episodes um, aired so far? Three, I think. Oh, cool. Three or four. Cool. All right. Um, I watched uh, the three-part mini mini doc on Netflix on the Boston Marathon Massacre. I watched mm -hmm. that, too. I watched that. That was... Uh, I don't know who's doing these pieces now on Netflix. That was really great. Mm. 
And I've seen all there is to see about, about to say, the Boston yeah. Marathon, but they have the victims, family members, and some of the victims there, like, giving their account of everything. Mm -hmm. And it's just well done. It's well done. I went from that to the three-part mini series. Uh, mini doc on Netflix about uh, the Malaysia Airlines flight. Mm -hmm. That one is like, whew. Mm -hmm. I, I definitely recommend them both. And I can't imagine. I can't imagine. Anyway, uh, and Rabbit Hole is still great, and I'm not watching it because I'm saving it. I'll be trying to, but as soon as Sunday get here, I'll be good, like, It's good like that? I'm on the order. That was good. That was good. good. They just keep. Jack Bauer does good? Kiefer Sutherland. I'm with Flip, but yeah. I think the name Jack Bauer, man. <laughs> no, it's, it's really not, though. It is. Can't do that. Jack that's Bauer, it, when he was Jack He's Bauer, from, Joe, that's when his shit was Certain up, people, man. you just be that name. I watched The Lost Boys in the movie theater or something. Mm -hmm. you got, you, I got you, I got you, I got you. I got it. And his pops was a legend. Yeah, yeah. He's known for 24. Now I'm with y'all, so I won't refute it, but he's. It's cool though. Whatever. Uh, NBA man, talk shit about your Knicks, man. Ish, you gonna apologize to me for saying I think Cleveland gonna beat y'all? I still think that. No, you were making a face when I was going on my run about how we were gonna win Game One. You said Knicks in five. I didn't think that y'all would win Game One either. Um, we gonna win Game Two too. We have beat this team. Every single time we see the them, game, Joe. Evan Mobley needs to gain 150 pounds fast. He missed 77 And Donovan layups. Mitchell is Jalen Brunson's son. Well, they must got some incest going on because that nigga was out there kicking y'all ass. He, but start, you're not hearing me. He kicks everybody's ass. All right. He does that to everybody. He's him. Mm -hmm. Jalen Brunson, when he sees him in front of him, he just goes crazy. Fish he loose. looks for him. He looks for him. Pick and roll, bring him to me. No, don't try to stay with your man. Get over here. Listen, and I'm not even talking to you. Congratulations to the Knicks <laughs> on winning the game. I want to go on break. I, I almost want to say that Jalen Brunson is damn near the best point guard I've ever seen as a Nick. Now, I haven't seen Walt Frazier. I haven't seen Earl Monroe, all of that. I, what, I don't know about all of that. <laughs> but Nick Mark Jackson, Nick Rod Strickland, Nick uh, Derek Harper, Nick Chris Childs, Nick Stephon Marbury, Charlie Ward, and I don't want to go over to all the other bums that I've seen as uh, Nick point guards, but there's some catastrophes there. Jalen Brunson is just a warrior, warrior, warrior. I love Josh Hart. He might not play tonight. I'm a little upset about that, but I feel good about the Knicks. And forget about the Knicks because I think the Knicks win that series rather easily. I was real mad that Tyler Hero goes down for Miami for two Word. weeks when they when they win game one Word. in Milwaukee. Because I would much rather the Knicks play Miami mm -hmm. than Greek Freak and them boys. Depends on if Greek Freak is healthy. But he'll come back. He's that. coming back. Yeah, yeah he's, he's coming back. back. Yeah. Or I want Miami to injure him real good so he sit down for a while. <laughs> You're not supposed to say that. No, it's fucked up. That's fucked up. But. Finger or something. Something like sit down for a series. Get out of here, man. <laughs> the fuck. And I wanna, I wanna run into the little white boy that I hate. That little white boy. I don't, I don't Grace oh, Grayson. Grayson. Yeah. He's balling though. He always. He's he balling. He, he's balling. He balls down. Yeah. But still, I don't fuck with him. I'm fucking with him. Congrats to the Knicks. I like, I like how we look, and I'm glad I never am on record saying anything bad about that Jalen Brunson sign. Congrats to the Sixers. What? Nigga? We, we shouting out our team? Who y'all playing? Somebody. We up 2-0. That's the point. Fuck. The six seed. That's what we playing. Come on, Laker talk. Get your shit off. Yeah, come on. Y'all won a game? We did. Um, ain't much to say. I think that uh, now I, I'm, I didn't know that Steven Adams and the other big dude from Memphis were hurt. Mm -hmm. I think we beat them now. Um, they don't have no bigs other than the shot blocker extraordinaire. I and, think they and just John's hands fucked up. I think they're just too small. Ja got to chill out. No, his hands fucked up. He has to chill uh, out. Ja got to start tapering his game. He young. Ja be falling every play, dog. He lands awkwardly every play. He uh, he hit the ground like AD hit the ground more than Ja, but <laughs> Ja got to chill out. He's going to hit the ground. Out. Yeah, he is. But um, no, nah, I think we'll beat them now um, rather easily. Uh, they're just too small. Okay. 
And that's our sports. That's it. Phoenix. Yeah. What about Phoenix? They took an L. Phoenix. I didn't know uh, what you call it was hurt neither. Pain. Chris Paul can't play 30, 40 minutes a game. He too old for that, my nigga. He played 30, 40 minutes a game chasing them niggas. Russell Westbrook <laughs> running around like he's 17, <laughs> jumping out the gym. Going up in the press. In the, yeah, in the yeah, suite. Yeah, you see him yeah, going yeah, to the yeah, suite? Yeah. He got, I, it, it might be rough for them. Phoenix might be taking their ass home. That'll be sad, yo. Clippers, hey. Clippers look amazing. Clippers are good, though. With no Paul George, the Clippers look amazing. Yeah, they deep. won one game. Shut up. You know who else want to send somebody home bad? Sacramento. Sure do. They're playing. They want to sit. They're hungry, home. and their fan base is hungry. Yes. It's going to be tough to win in Sacramento for the rest of this playoffs. Oh, please. They was young at home. They're going to get clipped, too. Bottom. Are they up 2-0? Yeah. Up 2-0. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Against champions, though. Mm. It's different. they never been down 2-0. Playoffs. It's champions, though. I'm not. I, it's bro, champions, though. Steph is Steph. Clay is Clay, and Draymond is Draymond. I'm just saying. Do y'all feel like he should be suspended for um, stepping on dude's chest? No. In the last no. game? I don't he, so. It could have been much worse. Like, if he wanted to stomp on him, he could have. I think that when he pulled his leg from him, he ain't really had no way to put his foot but on him. But if you watch it, he ain't, like, dig in. Yes. He, like, he could have stomped on him, stomped mm. on him. Mm. He put his chest and it kind of hopped up off of him. I don't necessarily but think if it was you put your foot and hop off, you know the, the you weight. You grab my leg. You know the weight is going on him, though. I know, but he could have. He didn't stomp him. No, he could have pushed down. You guys should do a gem- demonstration right now. No, nah, cool. <laughs> no, okay. I ain't see OE. No, but if, if you go like this, but if you hold your foot and you go like this and you you know all the weight is going down there. Yeah, he's EOC. <laughs> Everything over contact. Yeah, everything yeah. over contact. <laughs> everything is over contact. <laughs> but no, nah, I, I don't think he should be suspended. I, I watched it. Do y'all he, think he, that Draymond or Clay Thompson uh, deserve a max, not deserve, but no. will get a max contract from another team? Yeah, in desperation. A lot of teams got money to spend. I think Clay will get it. Oh, Clay if you can, can get it, that. then you can get it. No, get it. You, you can go get, get it, it. you're worth it. Sacramento got enough money. They said Sacramento got mad bread left over the way the team is constructed. Um, I wouldn't give them 30. I wouldn't max them out. They too old. Shit, you put them on a team like Sacramento, who's looking really good right now, though. That's probably worth it to them. We'll see. No. It's been a, it's been a great first round thus far. Definitely, yeah. Has. This is one of the more interesting NBA playoffs that I've watched mm-hmm. in a while. I like it. I, I, honestly, outside of um, Philly, there's really no guarantees. Philly ain't guaranteed, man. Anybody can win any night, you know. Hey, shut the <laughs> fuck up. <laughs> and and Boston, fan right there. I think Boston going one too. But. Uh, yeah, I don't want them niggas to win. Anything man. else burning a hole in our hearts that we have to uh, get out? Sports. Uh, Jalen. Jalen. Yeah. Got to congratulate Jalen. Have to. Then congratulate him. Uh, Jalen Hurts signs the biggest deal in NFL history. Yep. Was it the biggest deal for a quarterback or just any position? Any, any position. Deal any position. Quarterbacks what, always make the most What's the deal? What was it, 225? 255. 255. Well, I think 197 guaranteed. Well, yeah, one, 190. Somewhere in there. 190 yeah. something guaranteed. Wow. I'd like to congratulate his agent, Nicole Lynn. Yes, indeed. He should, okay. Nicole won't be playing with him. Come on. She runs the NFL. 179 guaranteed. Okay. Nicole Lynn, um, Basically, is taking doing a fucking rich Paul to the NFL. Young black, I lady. love that. She's dope. I love that. Shelter. And it's the, it's the biggest deal, uh, the biggest contract in terms of average annual value in NFL history, because um, Deshaun's two thirty fully guaranteed is still the the biggest guaranteed contract. Mm-hmm. But still, salute, so, salute that, salute, absolutely. We said we couldn't play quarterback. You know what I mean? Shout out to him. Shout out to all of them. Mm-hmm. Congrats. Lamar sitting somewhere right now, punching the air. Some bullshit. Jalen Hurts better than Lamar Jackson? No. No. But he's accomplished more than Lamar has can in this. say no? Yes, you can say no. It's a fair one, yo. It's a fair one. You guys talk a lot about... Um, about his injuries, though. Marketing. Hmm? This is marketing. <laughs> Look what marketing does. What about the guy that was not, that didn't want to get that? Um, the team wasn't offering him. That's what he's talking about. Lamar Jackson. Lamar Jackson. Yeah. Okay. That's what they're saying. Which one is better? Uh, yo, if anybody out there is having a tough week, toughen up, bitch ass nigga. 
Look yourself in the mirror and talk to you. <laughs> so you can get through this. Uh, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. Wait a minute! Hey, I got what I wanted. Yeah, didn't I? Can't feel nothing. Super human, even when I'm fucking. Fire grub, popping, mad. Hey, auto tune in, zero. Mo shit. Hey, what else? All right, it's the nigga that made this can't be overrated. Yes, he can. I don't know. Mm-hmm. What a Molly was. Wow. Ow. Stripping pudding. Wow. Brain like Berkeley. Made a record Hey. Keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there until the next time. I bid you adieu. Farewell. Adios. Arriva Dirty. Hasta la vista. Au revoir. Remember, life is a series of moments and moments past, so let's make this one last as if it's all we have. All right, y'all hold it down, man. We'll be back same time, same place next week. I don't know what these dudes are doing. If it's a pod on Friday, it's up to them. Y'all ask them. I'll be going shaking my ass. Oh, yeah, I didn't even tell y'all. I seen, seen uh, friend of the show, Zaire, last week in Starless. Oh, word. Seen my man, Zaire. Ain't know I'll be in there. You know what I mean? I caught him. We got him. <laughs> we fucking got him. Got him. Round. Y'all hold it down, man. We be gone. Go Nick tape, Nick tape, Nick tape, Nick tape, Nick tape. Hey, anybody got good plans this week? Good plans this week? Lit. Come on before you start harmonizing with the background because I'm turning it back no. up. Y'all got good plans? Good plans? Yeah, go, go, fuck go, with, go fuck with Banks. Oh, yeah, Banks. Banks album this Friday. Banks album this Friday. Jove, rest in peace. Banks album this Friday. Let's go. Pretty girls involved with me making pretty love. I'm going back to Smash Therapy. All right, man, y'all hold it down. Y'all have a good time. Shout out to James Fallenroy just because. Remember when number three tweeted he needed that beat? Bless you. Thank you. Yes, I do. It's a long, long day. It's a great day. Check this. Check this. Nigga, no, shut up. Ain't nobody trying to be depressed. We out of here. What the wrong you, Joe Biden? You've never you've never heard of Joe Button? JBP, JBP, where would you be without the JBP? Now nah, don't cut me off. Don't if you cut me fell off. Fell off that chair, my nigga. I'd have been no good. Hi, Daddy. You? Have a great day. Oh, I love you too. All right, gunshot. New Joe Biden. <laughs>